Okay, what's up, people over on YouTube? Um, I'm back at playing Hogwarts, Hogwarts Legacy. But before I do so, y'all, I hope y'all have a wonderful Thursday. I hope your Thursday is filled with joy, happiness, love, and light. Also, I dropped a new video yesterday, y'all. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. It is part seven. It is part seven of a playtale requiem um the link to the video is in the description box down below so i'll appreciate it once this once you finish watching this live stream to um like the video and um subscribe by liking the video it will help with youtube to push the content to be seen by more people on the platform also don't forget to like this live stream as well okay y'all now I can't believe I gotta say this, but R.I.P. to Neville Carmichael. R.I.P. Oh, wrong sound effect. Oh, wrong sound effect. My bad. R.I.P. To, to 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 Neville Carmichael. Yes, 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 yes. Let me tell you what happened. Let me tell you what happened. <sighs> So, um, <laughs> I'm getting emotional. So Neville went to visit, you know, Professor Thick, and you know how they go on these little ventures together. Well, before um Neville decided to speak to Professor Thick. He had something that he wanted to tell Professor Fig from the first time that they met, but he didn't know when the right time to say it. So while they was going to their destination, Neville, he pulled out a pen and paper and was writing a letter. Professor Fig was sitting across from him and he was asking Neville, what is it that you're writing there? And Neville told him, oh, it's nothing. So by the time they reached their destination, Neville finished writing what he had to write on that letter. He folded up and he put it in his pocket. While they was going to retrieve, what they, while they was going to retrieve uh, what they were trying to get, an enemy came enemy came right so Neville and Professor Fig they was ready for action right so it was fighting the enemies it was fighting the enemies it was fighting the enemies right it was fighting the enemies it was fighting the enemies right fighting the enemy like this fighting the enemy in the middle of them fighting um the enemy used Avocadabra and was trying to kill Professor Fig um, Neville seen it, right? And Neville, he jumped. And he blocked it, right? And he got hit with the avocadabra. And um, instead of mid Professor Fig, so he knocked back and Professor Fig caught him. And then in the middle of Professor but in the middle of him being blasted away with the enemy using Avocadabra, the letter fell out. Wait, put my music back on. The letter fell back out of his pocket. That he was writing while he was going to his destination with Professor Fig, right? Y'all onto what I'm saying? <sighs> Professor Fig, he was crying because he knew that Neville was special. He knew it. And the fact that Neville died while protecting him made him feel like he was, a, you know, but like it was, it wasn't meant. Like it wasn't meant for Neville to die. It was him. It was meant for him to die. So Professor Fig, he seen the letter that was a few inches away from um, um, Neville's body, his dead carcass. So Professor Fig, he unfolded the letter, and the letter said, "Dear Professor Fig, I wanted to tell you this the first time we met." But I am not the student that was supposed to come 
to Hogwarts Legacy. Instead, it was my it was my twin brother. But Professor Fig, when he read that, he was he was even sad because not only did Neville die, but he wasn't even meant to go on these adventures with him. So, at the end of the letter, Neville said, Please tell my brother, Hezekiah, that I'm sorry. Because when it was little, when Hezekiah and when Hezekiah and Neville, when it was little, I got my video on private. When Hezekiah and Neville, when it was younger, Neville told Hezekiah, because Neville was the oldest. No, Hezekiah the oldest, my bad. Hezekiah told Neville that they that he was all that he, he will always look out for him because their mother died when she had both of them. They are twins. I forgot to say that they are twins. Um, her, their mother died when she had both of them, right? And music, 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 music. I'm sorry, y'all. She died when they had both of them, and their father became very depressive he became very depressive and um he became uh, an alcoholic and he didn't really care about what happened uh with uh neville and hezekiah because he was grieving over his wife's death right so at the end of the letter um neville told professor fig please tell my brother that i'm sorry were taking his spot and can you tell him that um uh, uh 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 the name he told the name of the person that killed him and that um i'm sorry that he didn't fulfill that he didn't fulfill um his brother promise so neville crying <laughs> crying or reading the letter because he know how much it affected him okay so a couple days later uh, 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 Neville met it with Hezekiah. Hezekiah, um, Paul Michael. And he told Hezekiah about the situation. Hezekiah heard about the news and fell to his knees and wept. He wept because he remembered that promise that he made to his brother. So now, Hezekiah is now enrolled into... Hogwarts legacy, no Hogwarts, because not only is he trying to become a, a, a strong wizard, he is trying to avenge the person that killed his brother. So, long story short, I, <laughs> long story short, I had to start over. <laughs> to start over y'all I had to start over because when I was streaming when I was trying to open up OBS <laughs> when I tried to open up OBS <laughs> when I was trying to play the game on the PC and open up OBS it kept on glitching so I decided to buy the game on, on, on my PlayStation and start over <laughs> But don't fret, y'all. Don't fret. Because Hezekiah, he's prepared for battle, y'all. He's prepared for battle. You see? He got the armor. He ain't playing, y'all. He ain't playing. He is not playing. He is not playing, y'all. And by the way, I had, to, I had to grind my butt off to get to where I'm at. <laughs> when, I was, when I was previously playing with... um um. Uh, Neville Carmichael. So now, we're on his new adventure with Hezekiah Carmichael. Um, Neville's Carmichael twin brother. And he is now enrolled in this school to become a stronger wizard and to kill the person that killed his brother. Along with the help of Professor Fig. Mm, let me find out I'm a good storyteller. Let me find out. Let me find out. That's my, that's my calling. Let me find out. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my God, I had to say, you see, I couldn't say, I couldn't say that I, I, I had to start over because I had to make it interesting on why I had to start over 
and, and, and the story behind Hezekiah because Hezekiah it never got the same last name, okay? I had to make it interesting. So yeah, <laughs> I was grinding that to yesterday off. It's like a job. It is. It's like a fun job. And I'm ready to get started, y'all. I'm ready to continue this journey with Neville's brother. Can we put RIP to Neville in the chat, y'all? RIP to Neville. He is gone, but he's definitely not forgotten. He is definitely not forgotten. Um, Let's get on with it, y'all. Let's get on with it. Yes, he will be missed. He will be missed. <sighs> oh, also, y'all, I found out a way. You know, you know when you use um Revealio and it makes that bell, that bell sound. Um, there's a way if you go to the settings and accessibility. So look, if you go, if you use uh uh Revealio. Let me go back to um, Hogwarts so y'all really know what I'm talking about. I learned this from a TikTok video. Let me fast travel. Oh, let me change the title on um, what's the name? I've on Twitch. Said that travel broadens the mind. I put Neville Carmichael in the category <laughs> instead of putting Hogwarts. <laughs> um, okay. So you know when you use Revelio? Revelio. Why is I making that sound? Well, usually when you use Revelio, make a bell sound. I don't hear it no more. If you go to um, settings, I learned about this in the um, in TikTok. TikTok been helping me a lot when it came to this game, like little tips. Um, if you go to accessibility, um, ba -ba 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 audio visualizer if you turn this on it activates or deactivates the audio visualizers which uses on-screen icons to indicate audio events so if you use that and well if you turn that on i'm trying to look for when um revelio makes that bell sound revelio ah uh. It's not, sh it's not doing it no more, y'all. Well, now, since you turn on audio visualizer, um, if you use Revelio, it will show you where the bell is located at. Because the bell usually shows you where the um, pages is at. How nice to see you. Because when I first played it, I'm like, every time I use Revelio, well, why I'm hearing that bell? Revelio. I don't see it no more. Oh my god, it's so embarrassing. Like I wanna show y'all in action, like where it's at, like what's happening, but I don't hear it. There we go. You see the bell? You see? This bell is supposed to show you where the pages is at. That's what somebody said on TikTok. Revelio. But now I'm trying to figure out where is it? Revelio. Okay, let's see. Let's see what this works. Let me try. I'm gonna to try to follow the bell. Because this is my first time doing this. So is it in here? No, it has to be down. It has to be down, 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 down. Time passes in the game, and I'm in Christmas time now, and snow is everywhere. It's so beautiful. Oh, really? Wow. I know in this game, I know in this game, when you be playing it, I don't know. In this game, when you play it, it's like Tom. You be so into it that Tommy going by mad fast in real life. Like you be think you play like for 30 minutes and then we look at the time like two hours pass. You like damn been in this game for like two hours. <laughs> Cause you just be so into exploring everything.
Revelio. And also, y'all, um, there was a, a drop uh, when um, when um, you will only get this outfit. Let me show y'all this uh, this Merlin's cloak. You will only get this if you watch uh, Avalanche Studio um, Twitch um, streams. So I got this when um, they were showcasing their office when it was live on Twitch one day. And that's the only way you can get this uh, Merlin's cloak. So yeah, look at this beauty. Look at this Merlin's cloak I got. Look at this Merlin's cloak I got, y'all. Um, but yeah, let me go back to my... Because I'm a soldier. Yeah. That's how I got the Merlin's cloak. I didn't watch it. Oh, man. Yeah, at least... Uh, at one point, they have uh, jack o' lanterns everywhere when you go through the falls. Awesome. Wow. Okay, so let me go and meet with. Uh, 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 um, what's the name? My goal in today's stream is to at least get my broom. Because I want to stop flying. That's my goal. I want to start flying. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelio. Good of you to come. My friend, Professor Fig, speaks highly of you and your resourcefulness. He was vague as to details, but mentioned your having tracked down a difficult-to-find book. Mm. I wondered if you'd be willing to do a little detective work on my behalf. Go on. Of course, Mr. Ollivander. Sounds most up my street. Wonderful. You see, about a century ago, an heirloom applewood wand with a fairy wing core went missing from this very shop. My great-aunt suspected a student named Richard Jackdaw. He'd been serving as an assistant here and suddenly vanished. Richard Jackdaw? Like the bird. Mm -mm. In fact, he was known to frequent the Hogwarts Owlry. We searched there, of course, but found no wand. We did find a series of statues similar to Jackdaw's. I'm certain they're a clue, but I cannot figure out where they lead. Jackdaw was last heard tittering about some pages with a map he'd stolen from Peeves. As you can imagine, the poltergeist was less than helpful. Jackdaw has last heard tittering about some pages with a map he stolen from Peeves. As you can imagine, the poltergeist was less than helpful. I'll have a look for you. You've certainly given me plenty to go on. Ah, you've brought hope to this old one maker's heart. Professor Fig was right. You are a remarkable student. One thing I wish this game had, like I wish one thing that the developers did for this game is to allow for um, players to cross save. Like, so say if you play this on like PS5, you'll be able to seek your data from your PS5 to like your PC or to like your stream deck. So I'll be able to continue my uh, continue my adventures um, when I'm on the stream deck because my stream deck coming tomorrow and I want to play I want to continue my adventure with um, Hezekiah on my stream deck, but they don't have cross save. I'm like wow, like that's something that they should have implemented. Hogsmeade, here I come. Especially when it comes with especially when it comes on the Switch. Like say if somebody wants to um, continue their journey on the Switch, like I feel like they should have did that um, when the game came out. Cause I don't want to start all over. Like, I want to continue my journey. Okay, so look how much I explored. By the way, you see how much I explored? I explored all right here. I have so much more to go. I gotta go all the way over here. I gotta do all over here. I'm gonna get over here eventually. Um, but as of now, I gotta go to. Um, over here. Um, 
Oh, no. oh, we got to up on a treasure map at the top of the tower. <laughs> yeah, eventually. <laughs> oh, you see the little dragon flying? Oh, I like that. I know, but this is my first time seeing that. Um, I get this track so easily. Okay, let's go. This game, this game looks so beautiful. Oh, she cold. She cold. She cold. You cold, baby girl? You cold? Hey, can I get your number? Can I get your number? Oh, she gave me the cold shoulder. I will shoot you. I will. Uh. Uh, perhaps mind what you're doing there. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Okay. Oh, she want to give me her number? And this cat? Uh. <laughs> I ain't no good. I ain't no good. I mean, Neville had to take his frustration on somebody after uh, the death of his brother. I mean, not, I mean, not Neville, Hezekiah. He had to um, take his frustration on somebody. You know what? I want to switch my outfit. I feel like this. I feel like this armor is only good for like a short period of time. I want to go back to this. Um, change the head. Pause. Um, to, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, let's see, what type of hat do I want? Probably this. And then change the glasses, change the glasses. Change the glasses, uh... Let's see, let's see, let's see to this. Okay, don't he look like his brother? He looks just like his brother. Sorry about that. Um. Yep, they twin brothers. Um. He just like he just look a little older than him, a little bit, because he was born. Um, he just he older than um, Neville by one minute, by one minute. Um, and that one minute make him look older. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's change his gear. Um, which one am I feeling? Ooh, I like that. Yes, yes, I like that. You like he, you like he belong in Assassin's Creed now. Um, but, 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 okay, I like that. I like that fit. I like that fit. I like that. And the bad thing about it is that, um, is that. This place has seen better days. Um, what about the, I, I, I forgot what I'm about to say. Um, forgot what I'm about to say. Yeah, Natty, Natty, Natty don't know that um Neville died, so she she still think that um Neville's still alive. And um, Neville told Professor Fig not to tell Natty because it's gonna break her little heart because you know she got feelings for Neville. Best thing in the world, finding a beast in your trap. Yeah, it's, it's very complicated, Mary. It's, it, as a Maddie. it's very complicated. It's very complicated. This is almost too easy. It is it's very complicated. Oh, forever. But bring up. Protect Ooh, my controller about to die. Oh my god. All the spell casting is draining my battery. Oh 
Okay. Hmm. Ooh! Oh! I never did that before. I never did that before. That just show y'all ya, ya, that Hezekiah, he is not one to be messed with. Oh my god, my first time seeing that. That surprised me. Ne Hezekiah is showing out. Who's up there? Is that? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, I see it. Nobody can see it. Is that all the incendio? Oh my god. How does that come from? Mmm. I never seen that either. Yo. Hezekiah, like I said, yeah, Hezekiah is stronger than his brother Neville. And he's proven it to y'all in our very eyes. Like, he exploded him. Look, what is this? Oh my God. All this time, when I was playing with Neville, when I wasn't streaming, he never did that. I mean, never. With Hezekiah, he never did that. Never. Right, let me find out that 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 um that that uh Hezekiah's anger is is bringing out his like uh his uh true powers. Oh my god! Like uh, he's really mad. He's really really mad. Look at the way he looking. Look at the way he look. He's mad, y'all. Look. You can't even see his eyes. Look, he's pissed. What is that? Oh, I thought that was a planet. He's pissed, y'all. Revelio. Now I don't blame him. I can't wait to get my broom so I can just fly off around. On another adventure, are we? Yeah, we off to another adventure. Ezekiah, he's he he joined um he joined the same um house as his brother Ravenclaw, but it looks like he's turning into a Slytherin. He like he's turning into a Slytherin. Look at. Just look how mad he look, y'all. Oh, he happy now. He happy now. At first, he was mad. I guess you do all that running, all that running is making him mad. Look at that little birdie, birdie, birdie. Yes. Oh man, I want to hit it. Oh, look at that little birdie, birdie, birdie. You know what? Hezekiah is, is being real evil today. 
like like the whole entire week he was all nice helping people and not killing no animals stuff like that today must be he don't care about the now. animals like it's a kaya he becoming more evil every second Don't mind me, Owls. I'm just here to help a friend. Now, where are those statues? Revelio. Accio. I recognize those. <laughs> Nothing. Ooh, what's that? I'll take that, thank you. I, I will scare me, y'all. Ever since that movie, The Fourth Kind, that was dealing with the owls and people being um, right, best abducted by aliens, I'll be looking, I'll be giving owls the shot um, from now on. No statues here. I'll be seeing, ooh, they probably working with the aliens. This'll do nicely. All these owls. Birds aren't afraid of heights. Perhaps I should look a bit higher. Oh, hey! Okay. Here's a welcome surprise. <laughs> Nothing. Oh, another one. I best keep looking. No statues here. Nothing. I'll do that, thank you. Oh, you look at the wrong thing. My best keep looking. Um John. Akio. Oh, statues here. This'll do nicely. Return the bird sculpture to their perches. <laughs> Nothing. Oh no! Oh, no, no, no. Let me show. I got another page. Yeah. About to be a level twenty-one. Uh. About to be a level twenty-one. Uh. About to be a level twenty-one. Okay, so let's see, let's see. Oh. Hmm, a map. It doesn't appear to be connected to the missing pages. Best hang on to it for now. Okay. Owls and owls owned by students can be found in the Hogwarts Owlery. Owlery. One is advised to explore carefully, keeping an eye out for owl droppings and regurgitated mouse skeletons. Oh, I remember um, in middle school, we had to um, we had to dissect an owl pellet. What's happening? And it had bones and stuff still in it. I was like, oh, I was disgusted. Solved my puzzle after all these years. Well done indeed. Good news. If you've got something to hide, you found the perfect spot. Richard Jackdaw, at your service. The Richard Jackdaw. So Mr. Ollivander was right. He wants his family wand back. 
goodness. I'd forgotten about that wand. I assure you, I don't have it on me. I'm almost certain I dropped it the moment I was beheaded in that cave. Oh, it was sheer folly to follow that map. What map? Ridiculous, really. Found it on some yellowed old pages Peeves had pilfered. Thought I could impress a girl. But that's a story for another day. So, you stole a wand and then followed a map on some pages that you took from Peeves and followed that map to your doom. Odd to hear it all reduced to such absurdity, but yes. Why do you care about some old wand? I don't really. Ollivander does. It's the pages I'm after. Might they be with the wand in the cave? Indeed. Say, here's an idea. Why don't you meet me at the edge of the Forbidden Forest? I'd be happy to show you where to find them. Why would I go to the Forbidden Forest if it's forbidden? Forbidden means nobody not allowed in the forest. Why would I go in there? Are you trying to get me set up to get killed? Just like my brother? Just like my brother? If that's the case, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to bring you back to life and then kill you again. Um... How did you lose your head? I think I can guess how you died, but who did it to you? I was having a look about when I suddenly sensed a refreshing breeze. After which I felt, well, light-headed. That's all I remember. Hence, if you do visit the cave, be prepared. I can't tell you what for specifically, but you seem a perceptive sort. Beware a light breeze. Beware a light breeze? What does that mean? Why did you take the wand? Why would you steal Mr. Ollivander's family wand? Yeah. The family were always going on about how special it was. So I took it. Who could resist? Sadly, it wasn't special enough to save my neck. I fully intended to return it once I learned it was only special for sentimental reasons. But as you can see, I never got the chance. How did you steal from Peeves? How is it possible to steal from Peeves? A poltergeist. Exactly. I didn't steal the pages from his ghostly form. I merely found them in his wake of destruction. Mm. He's got a penchant for wrecking things. Books, bottles, suits of armor. Whatever's likely to cause the most chaos. I doubt he even noticed they were gone. Okay, I'll see you at the forest. If that's the only way for me to get those pages, I'll meet you there. If you don't mind the sight of a, well, my decapitated skeleton, the wand and the pages are yours for the taking. Okay. Where you coming from? What? Uh, 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 uh. Well, he just he just came out of nowhere. So he was eavesdropping on my conversation with that ghost the whole entire time. You was eavesdropping? Are you working with the enemy? Are you working with the person that killed my brother? If so, tell me. Tell me right now. Tell me, Awa. I will shoot you. Act like you're interested in these owls. You're not interested in the owls. You're trying to eat off my conversation. Uh. Uh. Oh, sorry, owl. Sorry, I'm meant to kill you. I'm meant to hit M. Uh. Uh. Meet Richard uh, Jack Daw at the Forbidden Forest. Like, he just came out of nowhere, y'all. He gave me a fright. All these owls. We're going on a trip in our favorite rocket ship. Zooming through the skies. Little Einsteins. We ain't zooming through the skies, but we walking. <laughs> I can't wait to zoom through the skies when I get my broom. But right now, we walk into a well, run into our destination. Um Jump. Is there any no, no pages? <gasps> Do I have any fast travel to to um the Forbidden Forest? Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. I do, I do, I do, I do. Oh, okay. I'm going to run the instead. In case it might fight any enemies along the way. Why 
Why you so loud? Why you so loud? What's you? Why you so loud? Okay. What are you up to now? None of your business. Why you? Why are you so invested in what I have to do? You a statue, okay? Stay in the statue business. Don't stay in my business. But what are you up to now? None of your business. That's what I'm up to now. Okay. Do 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 do. We are on our way to meet Richard at the Forbidden Forest. Move out the way. Move out the way. Don't bump into me. Oh, you bump into me. I don't like nobody bumping into me. I don't like nobody bumping into me. Yes, I bur I burned your cheek. I burned your cheek with my power. Your cheek is burned. Oh, look at little bunny wabbit. Oh, look at little bunny wabbit. Okay. Ah, <sighs> the forbidden forest. <laughs> look, it says death. Do not enter. Yeah, this ghost is gonna let me die here. Look, this area has been declared dangerous by the Ministry of Magic. And the ghost want me to go inside here? <sighs> Let me be prepared. Let me be prepared. Let me prepare myself. <sighs> what does it say? What does it say? Forbidden forests. Caution. Centaurs. Frog sold here. Oh my god. What? Who put this here? It's not funny. Hey, whoever wrote this need to work with a penmanship. They work. They write like a kindergarten. Okay. <sighs> oh, oh, that scared me. Oh, look at the little deers. Hello. Do y'all know about Bambi? Oh, okay. Oh, wait, wait. Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be friends? Why can't we be? Okay. Ooh, mushrooms. Ooh, I do not want to get infected. The longer the last of us. Uh 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 uh. Okay. These deers are so rude. Like, I won't hurt them. Oh, they back again. Uh, hello. Oh no! Why can't we be friends? Oh, yo, he lost. He lost. I'm coming. <laughs> Stay still. <laughs> I'm coming. Do y'all know about Bambi? She's on Disney. <sighs> hello, hello. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. You ah, ah, ah. Rebellion. Oh, they don't want to be my friend, y'all. They do not want to be my friend. But it's okay. It's okay. Leech juice. Okay, so I'm here. Gotta be right here. Forget about your ideas. I didn't want to be your friends anyway. <laughs> friends with this? Me? <laughs> Please. Here I ain't I that am. lonely. As good as my word. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. Only a Ravenclaw would travel this far in pursuit of knowledge. Of course. Well said. Now where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can. But I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Inframuros. I think it's Latin. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Okay. Follow Jack Dog to the Forbidden Forest. Aside from the birdbath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks, a stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is 
rather unfortunately coming back to me. Oh my god. It says do not enter Jack. He's gonna make me die, y'all. I'm going back, Jack. I'm going back. Uh uh. Uh oh my god. Oh my god, they want me to die. They set me up. I'm gonna die just like my brother. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the more I'm remembering. Probably best I leave you to it. Simply oh. stick to the path and keep a sharp eye out for that bird bath. Adieu. Bless you. Is that Latin? Or Greek? Hmm. Okay. The thing you saying, saying you said at you. Jack, Jack. Jack Doll. I am not I'm not trying to visit where you died. Uh uh. You on your own. What's over here? What's this? Oh. <sighs> Nice to see you too, ho. Okay. Hit a flame. Uh, 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 uh. <gasps> I'm scared. Oh. Oh my god. Nothing to do now but keep going. Okay. The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Look how many signs they got up on this tree! Over there! Danger, turn back! I wish I can, but I can't! Oh my god! Oh my god! You know what, Hezekiah? You don't run away. In the face of danger, you embrace it. You fight it. You hear me? Nod your head if you agree with me. Okay, come on, let's do this. Ooh, this is pretty. Oh, look at a little puffy puff. Revelio. Oh, look at a little puffy puff. Hello there, puffy puffs. Hi. What happened if I hit one? Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I was I was just curious. Okay. 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 Oh. Centaurs. Oh my god. This is just like Prison of Azkaban. Am I gonna meet a giant? Or I might meet Hagrid's brother. What if I go to the centaurs? Would they attack me? Let's see. Centaurs! We are friend, not food. Oh, 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 Centaurs, watch behind you. You got a spider. I'll protect you. I'll protect you. Uh, uh, help me, Centaurs. Help me. I helped you. Help me. It just. Y'all, the Centaurs see that I'm in danger after I was trying to help them, and then they're going to help me? Forget about them. You know what? I don't need no, I don't need no friends anyway. In the words of Drake, no new friends, no new friends, no new friends, no, no new. Don't, we go, don't go back in the ground, don't go back in the ground. Uh-uh, uh-uh, I better back away. Uh-uh, 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 no. Uh-uh, y'all bite me today, uh-uh. You better, you better go there with your brother, uh-uh. They don't know who they messing with. They messing with Hezekiah. Okay, okay, okay. Let me just get this real quick. I know, I know. Let me just get the, the items, the spider fangs, and continue on when I gotta go. Oh, oh, what happened? What was that? Revelio. Okay. Look at this beautiful water. Look at this beautiful water. I love the water. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. Okay. Oh, this is looking familiar, y'all. This is when um, um, when um, Harry was attacked by the um Dementors. This is when Harry was attacked by the Dementors, and he used Expecto Patronum. Oh. oh. He was like, he was like Harry was like. 
My Harry was like, my father gonna save me. My father. And he's seeing himself getting sucked up by the Dementor. He's like, my father gonna save me anytime. And Hermione was like, boy, you better go and save yourself before you die. He was like, you right, Hermione. He came, he went up there. He was like, expecto patronum. Wheel, 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 wheel. And got rid of the Dementors. Thinking that was daddy. His daddy was somewhere with his mother. There it is. Just as Jackdaw described. Okay. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Revelio. Anything important around here? What was this? Intramuros. Oh, oh, wait, oh my God, you got me spilling water. Oh my God, the thing scared me. What was that? That just, wait, what was that? Attack! Oh. Ah, you seem tired. You gonna be tired. Oh, God. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Oh my God, okay, you got that, you got that. Shut up. Mm. Come over here. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come on. Get over here. Oh man. Take that. Come on, come over here, come over here. No, I'll come over to you. Uh, take that. Uh, uh, mm, 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 mm. uh, uh, mm. Aha, aha, I thought you were gonna do something. You say you tired, you're gonna fall asleep. We'll report back to Ranrock now. Okay. Let's see where Jack Dora's led me. They thought they was gonna eat? Like, aha! Uh -huh. They might as well have Sakaya. They might as well have Sakaya. They don't know who they messing with, y'all. They don't know who they messing with. Okay, on the missing pages. I wonder how big this place is. Oh, bats. What is that? I'm not Batman. I don't need a checkpoint yet. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. Okay, so let's see. Let's go over here. Earn I wonder this. if any of these spells will help me through this. too easy to be honest I'm playing better on the um on the controller than I did on the um on PC I'm playing better on the PS5 than I did when I was playing this game on the PC combat wise like I was never um it was hard for me to um dodge and use the top abilities when I was playing on the on the PC you just looking at me? You just looking at me? You ain't doing nothing? Come on, come on, come on. Come on, you, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? You better, you better back away. Uh, 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 uh. Don't touch me. 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 <laughs> I hate spiders. I hate snakes. I 
case mix. Spiders? Uh... Now, if it's a Black Widow, then yeah. But if it's like a normal spider, I don't have a problem with that. Oh, so this is a dungeon. I can't equip my gear. Oh, this is a dungeon. Okay, okay, okay. I just wish I had. I would just wish I knew how much um, inventory I have left. I just like the way this costume looks on him. This game looks so good on the PS5. I mean, it looked good on the PC too, but like I said, the reason why I decided to play this on the PS5 instead of uh, continue playing on the PC was that um, every time I play this game on the PC and open up OBS, it starts lagging a lot. So I'm like, I might as well just play it on the PS5, so that way it won't be as laggy. Well, don't be laggy. Can solve this, so can I. What's over here? What is that? That platform ought to be able to float straight to me. Okay. So if I pull this, uh, um, pull that. Let me say, Akio. I must be about to get ready and learn a new ability because. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. I think. So I gotta pull this to me. Okay. Go up here. Pull this to me. Right, 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 right. Jump on this. And then use this. Yup, yup, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, boom. I did it. I thought I heard somebody talking. Revelio. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Embroidered formal but uniform. I may as well help myself to this. Okay. So. Oh, where are you coming from? Where are you coming from? You better, you better go back where you came from. I think they were gonna do something. It was gonna do nothing. In touched chest. Teratol wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. Okay. Oh, I'm about to be level 21, y'all. Okay. Like that. Okay. Do that. Do that. Do that. Do that. I did it. Remarkable. Okay. What's around here? I thought I heard a spider. I thought I heard an itsy bitsy spider. Yup, I did. Uh, uh, get down from there. I killed your brothers, but you're gonna do about it. I killed, oh. I killed your sister. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. I 
killed your whole family with a bunch of useless fighters. Ooh, what's over here? Ooh, what's in this chest? That's odd. I'd have thought Jack would have been interested in this loot, but there's only no got one thing that um might increase my attributes. The rest of them is not. Ooh. Uh, okay, I went over there. Let me go back over here. Hey, this cave is beautiful. It's a good thing Jack Daw didn't fall down there. Oh my God! Mm, 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 mm. They might as well call me the exterminator in this dungeon. I'm the exterminator. What's over here? Okay, so I'm supposed to go over there. So what about over here? What's over here? Thought you ate? Thought you ate? Thought you ate? Thought you ate? Mm, mm. Take that. Mm. Uh. <laughs> Any more? Oh, uh, take that. Run away. Uh, I'm so close. Okay. I hate spiders. I don't mind snakes. Makes sense. I'm in Slytherin. Yeah, it does. It does. Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm. But I may as well help myself to this. I remember one time I was in the subway. And you know those big giant snakes? Well, in New York, it's like a boardwalk. And like there's these people with snakes around their necks. The big giant heavy duty snakes. Heavy duty. Heavy duty snakes around their necks. It's those big thick snakes around their necks. So I was in the train, right? I was sitting by the door that that I was sitting close to the door that you uh uh that's uh that you do to when you're trying to go between the carts. So I was sitting close towards that door, right? Um and somebody uh, came in the train with one of those big giant snakes around his neck and he was standing right next to me as I was sitting down. So I was sitting down right here and the guy, I was sitting down right here and the guy was right here with the snake around his neck. Y'all, that snake looked at me, raised up and was just like this in my face. I was trying so hard to keep my composure because I'm like, what the snake trying to do? <laughs> if I was if I was watching Harry Potter back then, I probably would have spoken snakes. I'm like, I see, I saw. Like, I would have did that if I did, if I watched Harry Potter back in the day. But I was scared for my life, y'all. Like that snake, like I was just minding my business, listening to music, minding my business. As soon as I seen that snake, looked at me and just rose up and was like this in front of my face, like this. I was scared. <laughs> as soon as the train stopped, I let me get off. I let me get off. I'm like I can't. I can't. That was the most terrifying experience in my life. I was thinking to myself, I said, "Why would this guy bring this big giant snake in the train with him?" I was mad. Cause that snake could have just wrapped around my neck and suffocated me. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Everything I'm getting is decreasing my attributes. Like, I want things to increase it. I'm trying to look for some um gear to increase my attributes, not to decrease it. 
Okay, so how do I get over there? I need one of those platform thingies. Revelio. Um, ba 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 ba. I'm loving it. Uh. Okay, should I? Oh. <laughs> Like I said, I'm the exterminator. Okay, would I be able to use that from over here? No. No. Um, how would I be able to get over there? Rebellion. Okay, so I gotta move this. Come on, come on. Come on. Come here. Come here, come here. Come here. Yup, yup, keep on coming. Pause, pause. Come on. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay. So now that I got that over there, let me go back around. Uh, let me go back around. Uh, jump. Uh, as a car, you could have made that. Try this again. Go in here, jump up. Right, right, right. And then jump on this. And then go over there. Oh wait, okay. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, made it. Oh, oh my god, another item. That decreases my attributes. An untouched chest. Tactile wasn't very thorough in his search of this cave. This dungeon is pointless. Akio. I know there are a few different endings of the game. Or we become evil. If I take that bad, I hope you can kill me. <laughs> I didn't know there was different endings of this game. Revelio. Akio. I just really hope, to be honest, I really hope that the I hope that the developers really think about. Um, enabling cross save for this game. Enabling cross save with some DLC content. Rebellion. I think one of the DC, I think one of DC, I think one of the DLC content that they're going to implement is Quidditch. There it but, is. The bridge, it's almost complete. But I think they're going to, um, these can't be the factors of the character. Oh my God, I couldn't block. I thought they, I think they're going to, um, make that part be, uh, multiplayer. Stupid part. Lumos. Oh my God, block. That's a Kaya. Oh, red spiders. Oh, I'm so scared. Oh, I'm so scared. 
Please, I picked it at level 10. Look, they're at level 13. Come on, come on, come on. Okay, okay, you got that, you got that. You wanna use your, you wanna use your special? Okay, I can use my special too. Take that, ho, take that. And I completed a challenge. And I completed a challenge. What you think you're gonna do? Take that. Oh, 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 okay, okay. You got your little son coming after me. You got your little son. Okay, you got your little son. But guess what? Your son could get it too. Your son could get it too. Your son could get it. Yep, I'm attacking your son. Don't be getting mad attacking your son. Don't be getting mad. Get glad, okay? Die, daddy, die. Yep, I killed your daddy. I killed your daddy. What you gonna do, brother and sister? Yo, I killed your brother, I, mean, I killed your daddy, and your sister gonna die. How you gonna die? You by yourself. You an orphan. You an orphan. You an orphan. Who's that, your auntie? She ain't adopting you. She dead too. She not adopting you. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Imagine how these spiders Come on. Multiplied since Jack uh, yes, I'm 21. Yes. I mean, I can go and drink now. Yes. I can drink now. I can drink some liquor. I could drink some liquor now. Okay. What else is over here? Yes. Yes, something that increased my attributes. Yes, finally. Help myself to this. What else is over here? These weak spiders, they're level 13, they're not level 21. They think they're gonna do something? About this, something about this bridge reminds me of God of War. I must be getting closer to Jack Doll's remains and those pages. Is that statues I see? Are they get ready for battle against me? I hate that they be giving us maps to follow for side quests and then be the most poorly drawn map that I brought. How am I <laughs> We meet again, Richard Jack Doll. Oh. Splinters must be what's left of Ollivander's wand. At least I can take the pages. Okay. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. Hmm. Is there something beyond this room? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Thanks, right, Kitty, y'all. Come on. Come on. Come on. Bring your ass over here. Uh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, oh, you think you, you think you wanna sneak behind me? You ain't in a project trying to sneak behind me. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Oh, wow, wow, you jump in the air, wow. Okay, you throw, ooh, wow, you throw your little ass. Who you think you is, you Thor? You think you Thor? Okay, okay, you stop me my back, okay. Okay. Guess what, I blocked that, uh. Uh, take that. Come on. Uh, mm, mm, mm. I'm not gonna be trying to use my special on y'all. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, uh. Okay, okay, okay. You got that. You got that. Uh, take that. Come on. I'm ready for y'all three. Come on. Come on. Come on. Boo Boo's my best friend on those quests. Y'all remember back in the day when games used to come out? And remember back in the day when games used to come out, they used to have like strategy books for it, for like that had tips and tricks. Especially for like Super Smash Brothers, like when it came out, like when it came out for like, like GameCube. Like a big giant strategy book that tells you about the characters and how to play with the characters and the movements. Those are the good days. Like they don't do that no more with these games. Like you gotta rely on Google now. Those strategy books should be thick. Should be thick with a whole bunch of information. Uh. Come on, come on, come on. Two 
two. Come on, two. Come on, it's getting y'all. Come on. It's uh. Oh wow, wow. I'm so scared. Wow. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yo, I'm tired of you. Uh. Uh. I'm Thor. I'm, I'm Thor too. I'm Thor too. Y'all don't like to throw y'all throw y'all weapons around and catch it. I can summon lightning. I can summon lightning. Come on. Uh, take that. You ain't gonna try to hit me. Bring your butt over here. Bring your butt over here so I can hit you. Hit your wee wee. Come on. Mm, 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 mm. Make you infertile. Make you infertile. Come on. Come on. Come on. Take. You know what? Come, come on. Come on. Uh, take this. Uh, bye. Bye. Ah, ah, ah. They thought they were gonna do something. They wasn't gonna do nothing. They wasn't gonna do nothing. But that's unnerving. What's happening? Oh. I've seen this before. In Gringotts and the restricted section. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, before I go there, there's a, there was a chest over here. I almost forgot about this. Ah. Uh, you know what? The, at least I can sell these for more money. At least I can sell these. This is a low level dungeon. Was more to this? Where am I? I don't know. Oh no, the room's starting to flood. Oh, you know how to swim. You never took those. You never took swimming lessons, Hezekiah. Oh, you're gonna drown. How am I being protected? What sort of magic is this? Like I say, y'all, he is stronger than his brother. He was meant to be at Hogwarts. His brother wasn't. His brother was actually low-key jealous that he was invited to be a student at Hogwarts, and he wasn't. His brother wasn't. He was low-key jealous. Neville was jealous of Hezekiah for the fact that he um, Hezekiah was invited to be a student, and Neville wasn't. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. What is this place? What is this? Revelio. I'm trying to see if there are any chests around. I don't see nothing. What happened if I step in the middle of this? What will happen? Oh. That's what happened. Cutscene. Can it be? Can it? What's up? Before I go and speak to him, let me see what's up these stairs. Okay, so I can't go there. Okay. Let me speak to him. It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. Rackham. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. Let's move his eye. He's you blind in one attention. eye. And might I presume I never remember making him blind in one eye. Ability. 
to see traces of ancient magic. Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss. But first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm. That is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Um, are you a seer? The statues and carvings in the house on the cliffside, those are of you. Are you a seer? I am. Did you know that I would be here? I cannot say more at present, except to say that your presence here does not entirely surprise me. Ooh. Why is this called the map chamber? I'm a bit confused, sir. Mm -hmm. Why is this room called the map chamber? I assure you that all will be clear once the book has been placed on the pedestal. Okay, I'll bring the book here. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We shall speak again once the book is in place. Okay, your connection to ancient magic has... Oh, I can unlock talents now! You will receive one talent point each time you increase your, withering, your wizarding level. You have new talent points to spend in the talents menu in your field guide. <gasps> oh! Oh! You earn talent points starting at level 5. You may spend these talent points as you wish to enhance your spells to increase your combat power, stealth, and more. Choose wisely. Talent points may, on, may only be spent once, so the number of talents you apply will be limited. Return here often to see new powerful talents await you. Level 15? I mean, level 5? Dang! Dang, why did they decide to show me so late in the game about this? Ooh. This talent improves your overall effectiveness. Dark art. These talents uh, increase your ability with the dark arts. Spells. These talents help improve your spell casting. Stealth. These talents improve your ability to sneak around. Room of requirement. These talents enhance your use of potions and combat plants. Oh, let's start off with let, let's start off with core. Let's start off with core. Okay. Basic cast airborne absorption. Basic cast impact on airborne enemies contribute more to the ancient magic meter. Required level set. Required the uh, level sixteen. So if they said if I'd be able to use these once I reach level five, why would they have this as a required level for me to get this once I'm level sixteen? That makes no sense. That's 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 too much discrepancies. Oh level five. Oh level five down here. Okay, <laughs> my bad. <laughs> I didn't see this. Um, basic cast mastery. Basic cast improve impacts reduce. Basic cast impacts reduce spell cooldowns. Um, successful Protego blocks will contribute to the ancient magic meter. Perfect Protego blocks will contribute to more. Holding down dodge allow you to vanish quickly. Oh, we getting that. Okay, I can dodge. Um, a new spell set is added. OR2 and tap the directional pad in the direction swap to and unlock spell set. Okay. Wait, what? Oh I'm getting that I'm getting that too. Wicked well hears you to a greater effect. We're getting that too. Um Ancient Magic. Throws, catches, and throws this arm in me weapons. Wait, what? Ancient magic throw catches and throws this arm in me weapons. Oh. Wait, a new spell set is added. <laughs> so what's different between this one and this one? No, not this one. What's the between that one and this one? What is this? 
Ooh. Get that. Successfully invaded an unlockable and unblockable attack with dodge which was an ancient match. Ooh, okay. Enemy struck with super far remains stunned for a longer period of time. Okay. Oh yeah, we need this. Okay, so let's see stealth. Allows to uh, uh, sprint. Oh, let's get that. Okay. Um, spells. Let's see this. Has at least oh, a ring of fire. Enemies near a target slain by Asio are also close to you. Oh. Enemies near a target let me see, are also levitated. Ooh, so we getting this. We getting this. And we getting this. Okay, let's see Dark Arts. Espiliramas has the same effect as a curse on enemies. Curse enemies take increased damage. Oh, wow. Stupefy has the same effect on the cursed enemies. Curse enemies take increased damage. Oh, wow. And then damage to a cursed target afflicts. Wow. Okay, so we got. So let's see what we're applying it. Endurance posts make you vulnerable and deflect projectiles back at enemies. Uh, for each Chinese chopping cabbage stone, a second chopping is generated at least. Oh! Get that. I think that's gonna come in handy. Dark Arts. It's Philly Ramis. I do learn, I do know that spell. Okay, I do have that spell. What is this? Okay, I, I use this a lot, so let me get this. Um, okay, let's get that. Um, okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see. Spells. Okay, so I got all of that. Let's go back to Koa. Let's go back to Koa. Ancient magic, remain stunned for a long period of time, heals you. Okay. Basic has impacts on elbow enemies because you're using more ancient magic. Basic moves spell. Okay, get that. Take off blocks. Okay. Should I get this even though I got this? I'm gonna I'm gonna hold off for that for now. Let me see. Uh ba 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 Okay, so let's see Dark Arts. I did that already. Which one I wanted to get next? So something I was holding off on. It wasn't it wasn't that. It wasn't that. Was it in spells? No. Woman requirement? Was it this? No. Let's see something. I want to see. Um. Oh, okay. So let me go back to my. Oh, I can't go back. Oh, I can't go back. Okay, good. Um. So let's go back to talents. Let me go back to Kua. Let's get this. So I get another slot. And then I have three talent points left. Which which ones am I going to spend these last three on? Um, basic more. Uh, Let me get this as well. 
I have two. Let's see, let's see, let's see. And the next level I'll be able to get these. Oh, these is okay. Stupefy deals direct damage on impact. There was something else that I wanted that I was holding off on. Hi, welcome to the stream, um, Robel. What was something else? So was this super fun mastery? Or was it one of these? Contribute to ancient music and the more. Okay, so I'm gonna so that's the potion. I don't want to stealth. I'm not curious about that. And one of them calls in, uh, endurance potion, makes you vulnerable and deflect the Um, let me get the help as well. Okay. Okay, let's see gear. Gear, 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 gear. Let's see. Ooh, by 10? Okay. Oh, look. I gotta sell some stuff, y'all. Y'all see? I got my uh, inventory and my gear thing full. So I gotta sell um, some things. Let's see. Decrease, decrease, decrease. Okay. Let's get this. Um, but change it to this one. Okay. Headwear. Let's see headwear. We want that. Outfit. Let's see outfit. Five three. Okay. Let's see this. <gasps> Ooh. But if we get that, let's see cloak and robes. Okay. So all these is not good. Neckwear. None of these aren't good either. So since we have that, let's see what other thing will I equip. What's this? Well, I look like I'm a priest. Um, ba, 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 da, 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 da. the thing about since I bought this um on the PS5, I didn't buy the deluxe edition, so I don't have the dark arts, unlike the uh, PC version. Because I feel like with every, I feel like the the, the dark arts um costume um matches with everything. I don't want that cape. Let's see what else. What else am I feeling? What about this? Okay, I feel like that matches. The purple, the gray, the gray of this. Okay, everything kind of match. The gray of this, different hues, but it's also gray, okay. Anything else? Challenges. Yeah, with the uh with the spiders, right? Oh. Okay, get this. And with the spider. Anti-venom. Oh. Now how do I how do I equip this? Like I got this for the um mongrels as well, but I don't know how to equip this. What is how do I equip this gear trait recipe? Okay, what other what other things that I got? Okay, yeah, I'm I'm almost done with getting all the fill pages, um, in the Highlands. I only got one more section left. They get eight more in the Highlands. I gotta complete this section and the same with um Hogwarts. I have a total of twenty seven. I need fifty in order to complete this uh side. 
Um, quest, 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 quest. Oh, I got that, got that, got that, got that. Okay, so let's see here. Let's go back to Gia. And then, which one was that again? It was... Wait, which one was that again? Uh, collections, not collections, challenges, uh, combat, I believe it was, dragon hide protector's cloak, so it was a cloak, dragon hide protector's cloak, this, ooh, I like that, I like that, I like that, I like that a lot, okay, Oh, I like that. Okay. So since he got that, we got to change his outfit now. We got to change it. We got to change it. Not too much. He, he will be hot under all of that. He will be hot. Um, okay. Showing a little neck meat. Showing a little neck meat. Um, let's see. Let's see which one talks to him the most. Ooh. Okay. I'm kind of feeling that, y'all. I'm kind of feeling this. Oh. Oh. It's like some, like some sleeping wear. Ooh, I'm also feeling this too. Okay, that matches a lot with this. So do this. Uh, I'm stuck between that and this. I feel like this have too many colors, like the purple, the black, and then this. I feel like I don't feel like it's like I don't feel like it complements each other. I feel like this complements each other more. Okay, 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 okay. We can look at that. Look at Hezekiah looking all fly. He looking all fly. Then we gotta change the headwear. Um, let's see. Okay. Look, he look grown. He look in his 20s. Well, he is level 21. Okay. Okay, Neville. Okay. Um, anything else? Collections. What else is in collections? Okay, that's collections. Um, bu -bu 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 West. Inventory. Okay. Look at him, y'all. Okay, let's exit the mat chamber. Ezekiah looking fly. He like he's born in Louisiana, you know. <laughs> it like, it like he can say, "Hey, baby." The map chamber. Why would I need the book? He like he said, "Hey, baby, I want a book," you know. He like he can play the piano. Handy resource indeed. Okay. Revelio. Oh. Okay. Oh, wrong bite, wrong bite, wrong bite. Uh, let's see, let's see. Um. Oh, what is this? Okay. I didn't the sound and both to the same, to, to different button. The same thing to different button. Wow. 
What happened? Rebellion. What did I do? Oh. Wait, what was that? That was for that? No, that can't be. Whoa, range just dropped like crazy. I'm back at Hogwarts. Okay, good. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Okay, before we do that. Hey, we did it! Oh, we need that. What's name? Where's that key? 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 You need to learn to pulso, the banishing charm. Useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. I'm gonna learn a new spell. But how do I get over there? Oh, the toad. Um, where's that key? That key has to be somewhere around here. Rebellio. There we go. I see it. I see you. I see you. Open it. Go, come, come by this little thing right here. Wait for it. 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 There we go. Okay, I think I need like four more house tokens. Revelio. And I'll be able to open up that um cabinet. And that not that cabinet, that chest. Anything around here? Already open that. Level two box. Oh, another one. Okay, keep my eyes on it. Do not. Okay, okay he's right here. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, wait, 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 wait. Now, ah! Ah, oh, I messed up. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. Oh, go. there we go. Okay. Rebellion. Ooh, a page somewhere. Right there. Allegedly, the location of the first known instance of an arguably successful casting of Bombard, a unknown caster unidentifiable. Okay. Revelio. Anything else? Oh, another one. Where? Where is it? Is it up here? No, it's not. What here, frog? Okay. 
Okay, so no pages is here. What's this? Oh, okay. Oh, what was that sound? Where is that key? Key, where you at? And there's another page around here somewhere too. Revelio. Lumos. There we go. I see you, Key. Come on. Let's go. Where is... Oh, right here. I almost forgot where this thing was at. Okay, wait for it. Oh, there we go. Sometimes be looking, I be missing, but it doesn't. Okay. How am I supposed to know how many tokens I have so far, y'all? Well, how many I need so far? Let me see if I go to my inventory. How many more do I need? How am I supposed to find that out? And I have to go here. Is it in collections? No. Traits? No. No. Oh, so this is how I'm supposed to... I need a, a, a Deary Crawl Feather. And then for this, I need Pupskin Fur. And then for this, I need puff skin fur. Puff skin fur. Okay. Tools. I have that. Enemies. Appearances. Um, reveal your pages. How many are collected? 80? I need a total of 150? Wow. Wow. I'm not that far from completing a getting all the video pages, y'all. Oh, look at a little puffy puff. Puff skins are round and fluffy beads, soft enough to cuddle but tough enough to be thrown around. Puff skins will eat almost anything, but their favorite meals is bogies. They are common household pets for wizarding families because they are easy to maintain. Oh, look at that little face. Yeah, what is this? Ew. Oh my god. Um, okay. So at least I know how to use those traits. Well, get those traits now. Um, I just wish I know how many tokens I need. Revelio. Let me go back down this way. I gotta find. I gotta find these pages. Like is that? It's like it's where? Where is it? What are you up to? Oh, now? I was in this room, but I can't go in there because I need the uh I guess the ability to unlock doors. Rebellion. I don't have that now. Any quests am I supposed to do here at Hogwarts? Let me see. Oh, what is this? Secret rooms. The room of requirement in the map chamber. In the yeah, in the map chamber. Um, any quests around here? What is this? <gasps> oh! In today's flying class, Madam Ko Koga Kogawa is reviewing basic broom flight and maneuverability! Oh! That's what I wanted to do! That's what I was trying to complete in today's stream. Like, I used to try to get the, uh, be able to fly. Like, that's what I wanted to accomplish. Oh my god, I'm about to get my broom! I'm 
before I do that, let me continue checking around. Um, to see if there's any more of those, um, tokens. Revelio. Okay. Let me start going to... Um, where is it? Hogwarts. Faculty Tower. No, I'm gonna go to Ravenclaw. The trophy room. Staircase. This is where I wanna go to. So I can put these tokens. Put these tokens inside the uh that chest. And then I'm going to go, before I go to do that um, broom quest, I want to go to Hogsmeade and sell some of this gear that I got. If it wasn't for that TikTok video, I would have never known um, what that bell sound means. Cause I thought that was just I thought I thought that was just the um the sound effect of the spell like the rebellion. But people in the comment section on that TikTok video that I seen they said no that bell means there's a a page nearby. Rebellion. So how many do I need place? That's it. I'm making good progress with place. those tokens. Place. Oh, I need one, two, three. I need four more, y'all. I need four more. Four more. Okay. So let me... Well, let me just act as if I'm leaving. In case I might find any... Uh, Agent, any more of those uh tokens on my way out? Revelio. Oh, this is making me dizzy. I see chess. Rebellion. Fear not, my young comrades. Oh, a page. A page. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, where the page go? Oh. That page came like a thief in the night. Okay, wait, 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 wait. We gotta get that page. We gotta get that page. We gotta get that page. Oh, wait, no. We gotta get that page. That page was like, aha. That page was like, aha, you ain't gonna get me. Guess what? Oh, wait, 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 wrong thing. Guess what? I did. Ha ha ha. Okay. Rebellion. See, like I said, good thing I'm walking out of this place instead of me trying to fast travel to Hogsmeade. Because if I did fast travel to Hogsmeade, I would have missed out on that page.
Too afraid to fight? <laughs> Anything over here? Revelio. No. And I'll also increase the range of my Revelio in the uh when I went to the ta the talents um section. No bells. Revelio. Nothing here. Nothing is around here. Okay. Let me fast travel to Hogsmeade. What is this? Conjuration spellcraft. I'll put Clint Silver with her nobody's up and three broomsticks. She mentioned something about a swarm of butterflies. Okay, so before I do that, I gotta go and buy some well, sell some things. So let me go to the near the one that's nearest to a vendor. Travel. And then I'm going to go and um complete this mission here at Hogwarts. Does it get I mean Hogsmeade. Then Hogsmeade. And then we'll go back to Hogsworth. Hogsworth to do that brooms mission. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Hello there. In the market for potions, are we? No, I'm in the market to sell some things. So we're gonna sell this. Boom. Sell this. Boom. Sell that. Boom. Sell this. Yeah. Sell that. Uh. Sell this. Uh. Sell that. Uh. Sell this. Adios. Goodbye. I don't need you. No more. Adios. Take this to the room requirements to reveal its quality. I mean, it's going to decrease my attributes, but let's see. Let's see. I'm kind of curious to see what it is. Um, sell that. Um, sell this. Boom. I got 6,918. Okay. Um, is there anything I want? I don't use my potions. Like my recipes. I hope to see okay. you again. Better you probably will. Know. You probably will. I love this little coat that he got on. Every time I come across your love, my battery is dying. Oh. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Um, untitled. Okay, so let's go to do this quest. We gotta talk to Clementine Willers Day. Hey, Clemmy. She called me. What she, did she just call me when I heard she just called me? me? But were you saying something? Oh, hello. Talking to myself. I'm a it's like she, it's like, it's like she said, oh, a nigger. That's what she said. I was on the precious butterflies I see near the edge of the forest. Whenever I come near, they fly off into it. When I was at Hogwarts, we truly were forbidden from entering the forest. Told horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. It's silly. But I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. 
You couldn't possibly find out, could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, yes. If you wouldn't mind. When did you hear about the forest? I need to what know before I go there. Horrible stories you were told about the Forbidden Forest. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness. Everything from students being mysteriously beheaded to terrifying <sighs> spider dens. Oh, trust me. You hear that at 11 years old. Congratulations, it Maddie. With you. Very well. If I have time, I shall see where they lead. Oh, how kind. Students these days have so much more courage than I ever did. You can usually find me right around here. I hope to see you soon. Okay. Rebellio. Oh, there's a place somewhere around here. The butterflies always seem to be on the fringes of the Forbidden Forest. Good luck. Oh, come tell us sounds so nice. Even though it's like she called me a nigga though. It has to be outside. Well, probably up the stairs. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Rebellion. If you were transported into the into this game, but you had to start from the beginning, do you think you could manage? You transported to this. If I was transported into this game, but I had to start from the beginning, do you think you could manage? Uh, to be honest, I don't even know because the Harry Potter is like it's dangerous. Like your life is always on the line. I might be too scared to be trying to do adventures like this. That butterfly quest feel like a lifetime ago for me. Okay, Maddie, don't rub it in. Don't rub it in. <laughs> I can manage because my wizard is me. I can manage because my wizard is me. I oh, don't know. If I had to transport myself into this game? Rebellion. To be honest, I think if I did, I think I might make the powers get to my head. I think I might be evil. I think it might feel like I'll be unstoppable. Cause I might be the I might be the type of wizard that be practicing like my spells every day and try to and try to make it better. I I see the bell, but I'm trying to. Nothing to give, sir. It was only the one. I'll serve Voldemort. Not gonna lie, he's too scary. Nah, I would not want to serve Voldemort. I need me the, the lock spell. <sighs> I can't wait to get that ability or that spell. Okay, so let's go and find the butterflies in the Forbidden Forest. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Revelio. I was looking at the games that was coming out for this year because I was um, planning on what games the, uh, that I'm going to stream for the rest of this year. And it feels like this is the only game that that is going to win Game of the Year. Like, I don't know any other games that will be nominated for Game of the Year. It's all the other games that's coming out for this year. It's like, okay, like, it's not something like, oh, that game's gonna be high. It's like, I try to learn as much as I can, but stay under the radar. Yeah, I think that's how I'm gonna, I think, I think that's how I'll be. Spider Man 2 and Final Fantasy 2 will be running for Game of the Year as well. Um, I think that comes out, um, 
I think Spider-Man 2 comes out next year. Because I was formulating a list for games that I wanted to um, stream this year and also games that I need to complete. You can't we gotta complete... We, we gotta, I gotta beat Bayonetta 3. I gotta beat um, Bully. I gotta beat. Um, I made a list. I made a list. There they are. She wasn't making it up. I, I made a list of games that I'm that uh, uh that's that I need to complete for this year as well. Well, we've come this far. Miss Willardsy might get an answer about these butterflies. Oh yeah, they must have deleted. They had released these. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta beat all of your fear for Resident Evil 4. I think I might be, I think I might go back to those games after I beat Resident Evil 4. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna continue playing this. Um, I think I'm gonna continue playing this and Dead Space. Um, until Resident Evil 4 comes out. I'm gonna continue playing Dead Space. I'm gonna, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna continue playing this until Resident Evil 4 comes out. And oh, then. Wow. After I beat Resident Evil 4, I'm gonna start going back to the older games that I that I um forgot about. Well, stop playing and go back to it and beat it. Ooh, an enemy! Because Atomic Heart comes out next week, but to be honest, I still don't know what that game is about. Like, I, I don't know what that game is about. Like, every time I see, like, like footage of that game, it's always, like, the, the, the main character killing something. Like, you don't never know what the story is about. So I'm like, what's the, like, when I'm supposed to be doing this game? True, because after Resident Evil 4, there isn't really any games that are coming out. So you can go back to it. Yeah. I think the next best game that's going to come out after Resident Evil 4 is... I don't know. I just see my list again. I think the next game that's going to come out after Resident Evil 4 that I want to play is... Um, Justice League. I mean, Suicide Squad. A castle. Kill the Justice League. Must have been quite stately in its time. Girl, don't be trying to, don't be trying to run away with your broom. Don't be trying to be a show-off. Don't be trying to be a show off. Don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. I'm gonna get my broom sooner or later. I'm gonna get my broom. I'm gonna rub it in all y'all faces. I'm gonna rub it in all y'all faces. All y'all faces. Um, how was I gonna see Resident Evil 4 and Star Wars Jedi are going to be my entire year? Yeah. Um, I gotta show you the list again. I said, I think I have like five games, five or four games as backlog. And then eight games that I want to play as well. For the whole entire year. I know one of them is, I know it's Dead Space. It's Dead Space, Resident Evil 4. Um, Dead Space, Resident Evil 4. Atomic Heart. Um, Suicide Squad. Near Automata. I still haven't played that game yet. Um... And a couple others. Unless a miracle happened, the Tekken 8 comes out. And oh, yeah, and Street Fighter. Street Fighter is another game I want to play. You just, you just reminded me about that. I seen Tekken, and I thought of Street Fighter. Unless a miracle What's happens, the Tekken 8 comes out this year. I'll be playing that, too. Now, I doubt it. It makes sense that Tekken is coming out next year. Because they want to give Street Fighter... It, it would be too much, because I feel like Street Fighter and Tekken will be competing with each other. So... I think it's smart for Capcom to let, um, to let, um, you know, is, did, did, did Capcom make Tekken? Well, it'd be, it'd be smart for the developers to let Star, um, Street Fighter have it shine and then come out with Tekken. Hello, Miss Willardy. Well, what happened? Did you find them? 
you still playing um Capcom Street Fighter. Yeah, Bandai. Yeah, you're right, Bandai. Yeah. So yeah, it makes sense that Capcom, that Bandai and and and, and Capcom is um letting their games have their time to shine. And that's for Persona 5. I'm gonna try it one more time. I'm gonna play it one more time to see if I really, 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 really wanna put my energy into that game. Eyes burning. They let me into the forest and reveal the treasure. Oh, how lovely! I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. <sighs> Perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see. Should I dare? Okay, I completed that. Okay, so I got that completed. Now I can go back to Hogwarts and do the broom mission. Do the broom. Oh, I want to go back to the what's name though? Broom requirement. How do I get back up there? Okay. Um, fast travel. Because I want to see. I want to see what's that, um, that gear that I got. And then put a marker. Oh, I can't put a marker. How am I supposed to get back to this place? How am I supposed to get back here? And what I came to realize is that for like the PS5 version of this game, it doesn't have like a loading screen that shows tips. Instead, it shows um, each house logo. That's their version of the loading screen. Oh, I might have to show him the book. He may take me to the room of requirements. That's what he might do. Okay. So, we just gonna keep that gear. We just gonna keep it until the time comes. We just gonna go to this mission. Track quest. Off on another adventure. I'm going to flying class. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. Because this is what I really want to accomplish in today's stream. To be able to get my broom. The loading tip screen, the, the loading screen tips be coming in handy. It does, it does. That was, that was one difference I realized when I uh, played the PS5 version compared to the PC version. Fear is weakness. I never fear. Rebellion. Oh, I hear the bell. Uh, it's probably through this way. Let me just go and get my broom. I'm hoping I get my tax before RE4 comes out. Yeah, and the good thing about RE4 is that it's priced at $60. It's not like 70 something dollars like the rest of these games that's coming out. So that's good for me. Yes! <gasps> Mr. Clothen, your attention, please. Stop flipping that broom for hitting my face. Flipping that broom around. Welcome a new student to our flying class. Hello, everybody. 
Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely. As broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop the loops will not be looked like, like he came from Louisiana. Class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. The who? Not a fan, I take it. <laughs> now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. I know he's sweating on, on all of that leather skin. Step up to your broom. Say up firmly and clearly. Then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Okay. Up. Up. Thank you. Now, your turn. Okay. Up. Up. Up, you stupid ratty school. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be. Uh. Uh, Schmidt for a while. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Look at him. And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Okay. Yes, yes, Shaw. I can finally fly. Good. Now. For your first lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Okay, do how do I take care? This will take some getting used to. School property. I want them returned in one This is piece. brilliant. Okay, so how how can I go faster? I'm going kind of slow. Speed it up. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your broom, let's see how well you manage with a more advanced exercise. Shall okay. We? Let's do this. Let's do it like Brutus. Okay. This next set yes. of rings will take oh, you oh, for more of a challenge. Yes. What a view. Yes. <laughs> wow, look at this view. Oh my, look at the clouds. Clouds look so real. Oh my God, look at the water. Look at the water. The water looks so Good. real. I've got this. Oh my God, you got this, Hezekiah. You got this, you got this. Oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced Wow, this is beautiful, y'all. This is beautiful and amazing. Wow. I can't wait for them to add the Quidditch. Oh, our aquatic like a DLC. Would like oh. to make an appearance once in a while. <gasps> oh. I can't wait for them to add DLC like for like Quidditch. Like a Quidditch DLC. You know how fun that would be? Huh. That wasn't too bad. Okay. You're doing good, Hezekiah. You see your brother Neville, he never made it this far. Oh, well done. At the moment. Oh, the way would hit you. Oh! I was about to hit him. <laughs> he mad. He said you stopped me. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I mean, I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. You better, but Everett. I'm getting ahead of myself. We met in the common room. I'm Everett Clopton. So, care to join me for a bit of high-flying fun? Let's do this. I don't care if we get in trouble. I like the sound of that. I can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Okay. The tour is about to begin. Let's do this. Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely as ever. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. This broom got some good steering. Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Whoa. Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is Everett flying so quickly? Yeah, thanks. Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Okay, how do I... Oh! Oh! oh. No, <laughs> you sure you're not part hippogriff? Oh, 
loving this! There's the famous bridge! Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it! And wow. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and a jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite the tour. Oh, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Got distracted. Wow. Oh, the Quidditch Arena. That's Kagawa's whistle. This concludes our tour. Okay. Let's hurry back. It still feels like I'm kind of going slow, though. Better hurry and hand in our brooms. Oh, oh, he, he, he attacking the brooms. Look how and cool he looks. You two been? Oh, I mean, I mean, I mean. Oh, hello, um, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Uh -huh. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for no. following my instructions. It was all his fault. It was all Mr. Everett. Clopton, you see my face? I'm disappointed in you. <laughs> You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But Professor, enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. Look at me. <laughs> it's eyes mad open. Chin up. That was some rather good flying. Thank you. Now, can I get the broom and keep it for myself? Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. It was. He was. He dusted you as soon as I whistled it off. He sure did. He sure did. He was. It, it, it seemed like he went even faster and left me behind. He was like, <laughs> you, I'm not trying to get in trouble. <laughs> um, I have no regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I, bought the I recommend it. visiting Albie Weeks at Spint, which is in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. Okay, Everett. Hey, but they get my broom. Complete main quest. Okay. Okay, let's see what challenge we got. Let's see what challenge we, we, we can get. Okay, quest. Um uh, okay. Legendary armor to tie it. Let's see how this looks. Legendary max. Legendary armored attire. Okay. Let's see how it looks, y'all. Let's see how it looks. Because right now I'm really feeling this coat that he got. Um, legendary armor attire. Let's see. Oh, wait, wait. Let's take this off. Let's take this off real quick. Oh, uh, oh, oh. Mm, mm. I mean, it kind of matches the gloves. Go above the gloves, but. I still like the way that looked with what did I have on previously? What did I have on previously? I forgot what I had on before. Also, okay, Professor Sharp wants me to take a test. Want me to test myself while under the influence of both the Maxima and the Door Distortions. You also like me to field test a focus potion. I might, I know to find potions and recipes at J. Pippin's potions. My field guide would not guide me through this assignment, but my map could still prove useful. 
Okay, so this is okay. So this is how I found it. Okay, so I need four more. Thirteen. 14, yeah, four more. Okay, appearances. The map portrays a forest, bridge, and candles. I might do this quest when I'm not streaming. Um. Let's. Map. It's the map. It's the map. It's the map. Um, Hogsmeade. And then... He said I had to go... Where? I think it was this? I think it was this. Okay. Let's travel. Does it get any more cozy? How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Okay. Sebastian, but why did you wait till I leave Hogwarts to tell me that? You should have told me that when I was there. When I was still at Hogwarts. Uh, Ooh. Revelio. I have an idea. Run by the Emma. Okay. Focus on your studies. Away from prying eyes and distractions. <laughs> Hello. Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came by before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Yeah. Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. Okay. Disrupted trade routes made you close? You said disrupted trade routes caused you to close, Spint Witches. Terrible it's been. Trade routes reported as unusable. Evidently, criminals were overtaking roads, threatening hamlets. I can fly safely almost anywhere, but you try flying with an inventory of brooms on your back. No easy feat. Right then, back to work. If a particular broom takes your fancy, just let me know. Okay. What else can you share about the brooms? Do you mind sharing more about your brooms? I have a passion for them. Every detail of every model. Take wind wisps, well known for their quality ash handles. You weavers are rare because some fear flying them, likely to do with the you one's darker reputation. Then you add the Ember Dash, known for its handsome appearance. Working with brooms every day makes me practically giddy. It's one of many reasons I cherish running this shop. Okay, I have a look around. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'm about, about to around. get a broom. Thank you. I'm about to get a broom. What are we looking for okay, today? Okay, let's see, let's see, let's see what I fancy. Let's see what I fancy. A comfortable and speedy broom with a unique woven design. The perfect broom for those with fiery temperament. Um, a broom enhanced, enchanted to celebrate your particular Hogwarts house bride. Finely crafted from ash. A broom is built for stability. A stylish broom with a light touch, quite literally. I want this. I want speed. I want to. You'll I be want... thrilled with that broom. I promise you. Okay, let me see what can I sell. I'm going to sell this to you. Nice okay. doing business with you. I got a broom. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Mm -hmm. Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you! I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. Ow. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct the broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Reyes, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What say? Let's do it. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. 
Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special price. That's what the I like. Tom a special should price. be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Rays will sort you out. Okay. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Okay, I will. I will. I will. Odds me in certain areas prohibit flying. Look for no flying icon near the mini map. Are you serious? <sighs> Can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Rebellion. Anything else around here? No. Okay. Hey, where do I have to go? Um, Hogs or Matt. I should go there. Let's test this broom out, y'all. Let's test it out. Rebellion. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Okay, uh, okay press L1. And then... <gasps> oh! Wee! Oh, I'm going so fast. Let me see, let me see, let me see, let me see. Let me see how my, my thing look in my gear section. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's unavailable right now. It's on the upgrades. Okay. Let's, let's hurry and complete this mission. Wee! See little circles around me? I'm breaking the sound barrier. I'm breaking the sound barrier. Look how fast he going. He looks scared. He looks look scared for his life. <laughs> Wee! You going down. You going down, down. You know, da, 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 da. Look, y'all got my broom. Aha, y'all got your jet. Aha, 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 aha. Oh, oh. Okay, okay. Wee! Okay. Hey, okay. you, Ravenclaw. Yep. Melda Rays? Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, and that was the end of that. The nerve. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Okay, Caught I'm better than you. Showing off in flying class with Clopton. You sound jealous. You really do. Seen someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Mm -hmm. Me, Slytherin Quidditch captain, jealous of you. Of course. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. Yeah. You're not even Slytherin. Okay, so. Squib for all I know. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Okay, thanks for Let's sticking around the title. Have a good night. Slytherin versus Ravenclaw. Let's go! Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I will also be streaming this game tomorrow as well. Come on. Made it. I miss. Success. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, oh. 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 Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. oh. I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. This is rather fun. Bop, bop, bop. 
Oh, I'm going too fast, y'all. I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast. I'm going too fast. Oh. 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 Come on, come on, come on, Neville. I mean, come on, come Michael. Come on. Um, Hezekiah, come on, come on. Come on, you got this. Two more. Two more. Two more. One more. Yes. Yes. This is all the fun. What you got to say about that? What you got to say about that? Uh, that's not... You, you must have cheated you. Please. Uh, I didn't cheat. Fine. You won. I'm just that good. Don't think this is over. You can't determine skill from one single trial. Okay. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible. But you're still going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. I don't want your respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. Period. And everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. Okay. You can try to prepare by racing this course again. No, I'm good. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. We'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Albie Weeks. Okay. Return to the podium. This is the podium. Ezekiah Carmichael. Oh, Ruby was number one? Oh, I'm a number two. Okay. I was so close to um, being Ruby. I suspect Mr. Weeks will be glad to hear how I fared. Okay, so I gotta turn back to Albie. Returning back to Albie. Albie. Michael, I want to know how high can I go? I'm going to real high, y'all. I'm going to real high. Oh, I'm going to real high. Wow, look at this view, y'all. Look at this view. Just look at this view. Just, just look at everything, y'all. Look. Look at this beauty. See all the trees. Wow. Okay, let's go. Ah, show my booty. The wind is the, 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 the wind is showing my booty. One thing that um, Hezekiah was jealous of when it came to Neville was the fact that Neville had a bigger butt than him. <laughs> um. Hogsmeade, here I come. With something to report, I hope. Yep. Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Yep. Tell me, was. how was the broom? A little Amazing. turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Hmm. That's precisely what I needed to know. Drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. Who has doubted you? Why would anyone doubt your ability to upgrade brooms? No, oh, you'd be surprised. People get set in their ways. Worry that fiddling with what's working fine will somehow ruin it. Whew. Those people don't appreciate the sense of freedom that comes with quality broom flight, nor do they appreciate all that's involved in the creative process. I have a friend in Rome who runs a shop like mine. Says it's worse there. <laughs> of course, they do nap in the afternoons from what I hear. 
And where would we be without enhancements? I mean, if Elliot Smethick had let the naysayers get to him, we would never have had the cushioning charm. I don't listen to him. Um, can't wait to hear him more. I'm excited to, go. to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. So, hmm. how to address the issue of altitude? So, are you gonna to upgrade speed? my bro? I, did you upgrade it already? I have to wait. Oh, man, especially to get the upgrade now. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Okay, so. Where do I have to go next? Hogsmeade? From here, what's this? J. Pippin's potion. Do you let me know if I can be of any assistance at all? Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you'd take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. Okay. Happy to help. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. I hope so, She's too. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Okay. I demand a delivery. Deliver three invisibility potions to Fatima Lying. Deliver, deliver these potions. It seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. There was a, a TikTok video about uh, the character always saying that every time they go to Hogsmeade. All roads lead to Hogsmeade. All roads lead to Hogsmeade. <laughs> There's also okay. another TikTok um, video about this game. When it when it when uh, somebody said when you go to a new place, you always use Revelio. <laughs> In every part, like I always be using Revelio. Revelio, Revelio, Revelio. You never want to miss out on those pages, y'all. You never want to miss out on those pages. And another thing I like about this game is that even though it's grindy, it's not. It's not one of those games that's annoying when you have to, you know, level up your character or um, uh, strengthen up your character. It's like, a, it's not annoying. Like, it's make, like, it's fun because you're just going around. And every time you go around somewhere, you find someplace new. Like this place, for example. Like, this someplace new. I've never been here And look, there's, there's a flying page around here somewhere. But yeah, the, the grinding in this game is fun. Grinding in this game is fun. Never like, oh, I gotta do this, oh, I gotta do that. It's worth it moving. It's like, what? ooh, what new adventure am I gonna go on right now? More like that. No, or, uh, ooh, I got this. I can't wait to get this, so I'll get this. You know what I mean? Because I hate when I play games in which I have to grind, and then it's like the grind is just like 
pointless or it takes you forever in a day to level up. Like this game, it doesn't take you forever in a day to level up. Like you, like I got to level twenty one or well, level twenty in like two days. In other games, it might take you like a like five I'm days to, try when I see one. to get to like the level that you want to get to. But this game, no, it's quick. Everything is just quick when it comes to leveling up. Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Incendio. Any other one? Revelio. Incendio. Revelio. Wait, did I do something wrong? So, I'm not supposed to go away from over here. Incendio. How is this supposed to be done? Revelio. I guess Incendio. I did it, I did it, I did it. I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it. Okay. Let me speak to this merchant over here to see what he got. Hello. Do you have anything for sale? That I do, but uh What's a student like yourself doing out here? Got yourself lost, did you? No. I like to explore. Just exploring the countryside a bit. Aye. <laughs> nice to break the routine now and then. Mm -hmm. Bit of a wanderer myself, in fact. The name's Leopold Babcock, and I am indeed here to sell. <laughs> now, for someone like yourself who is also prone to wander, I cannot understate the importance of keeping some Wigan World potion on hand. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't dare set foot in a place like the Forbidden Forest without a steady supply. You right about what that? Do you say, my well, good friend? thing about the Forbidden Forest is that those monsters and creatures are weak. Something to consider. Thank you for your help, Mr. Babcock. Hi. Let Babcock. me know if you see something you like. Okay. May I see your wares? What do you have for sale? So you're a potion seller. What he see got? if there's something you need. Oh. Buy an agile broom for the fly who wants to look impressive and demand when demonstrating their myriad skills. This is five thousand. That's all my money. That's mostly all my money. Ah, I might come back for that. So I still don't. I still don't have to upgrade yet. Do I? I don't think I have to upgrade yet. Oh, I do. Oh, it's highlighted. Okay. Okay, you can upgrade your broom expert with hockey. So I guess it's not time for me to upgrade yet. I'm gonna wait to the upgrade to see what's that about. Um. Okay. Are there any like fast travel blue flames around here? Here's another Merlin trowel right here. Let's go to it. I'm right around here anyway, so I might as well do it. Merlin trial, here I come. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I can fly over there. Whee! Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Okay. Not enough mallow sweet. Oh my god. Oh my god, we gotta go back to what's name, y'all? We gotta go back to Hogsmeade. We have to go back to Hogsmeade. 
so that I'll be able to get some more Mellow Sweet and do more of these Merlin Tribes. Um, go there. What's that waypoint? Because I don't want to keep on going to my adventures and not have Mallow Sweet for the these Merlin Tribes. So I'm going to try to get as many Merlin, uh, Mallow Sweets as I can and then go back to that uh, Merlin Tribe. I'm done with that last clip. Greetings! Please, take your time looking about. Room of a part of a new room that can be added to place to increase the yield. Okay, so where's your Mallow Sweet? Then you need Mallow Sweet. Okay. Now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Um, seed packs. Okay. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Now, let me go back to that right here. Ooh. I can't wait to get that um lock spell, y'all, because there's so many I feel like I'm missing out on so many pages because of those doors being locked. An honest day Rebellious. Look, I'm hearing a bell. I bet you I bet you is in one of these rooms. I bet you one of these flying pages is in one of those rooms with the locked doors. Thing the ministry banned on the ocean. Alright. Whee! Look, look how. Just look how. Look how the castle looks, dog. Wow. Looks beautiful. And they really did a good job making this game, y'all. They did a phenomenal job. And you can tell they took their time. Oh, he go oh, he going down. Oh, go back up. Whoa! I wish I'd be able to spin, like spin in a circle. I say, whoa, it's been in a circle. That would be amazing. Like, do tricks on the broom. Like, just stand up on it and stuff like that. That would be nice. It must feel amazing to, to ride in this. Like, once you get used to flying, like, if I was, like, a, a wizard in real life like this, and once I get comfortable flying on this broom, I bet you feel good with that breeze. Just, uh... Hitting you in your face. I should that feel amazing. Okay. Watch out! Oh, watch out! Oh! I want to know can enemies still hit you while you're still flying around. That would be amazing if they can. Cause I see a health bar. So I'm guessing they can. Can I cast my magic while I'm still in the broom? Hold, dismount, descend, ascend. Try who flight speed. Speed burst. It would be nice if I could use my magic while I'm in the broom. I use my spells. Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Okay. Go down. I know what that means. Man use the mine. mallow speed. Rebellion. What did I do? What 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 did I do? What's that over there? I got so much chest. <sighs> I'm just swimming, I'm just swimming. 
Revelio. that sound? Um, Rebellion of the chest. There's a chest over there. There's a bag over Looking here. Okay, I got a tan nightcap. Always late for taking. What is that? Oh, this might. Okay. That pippin should have been here by now. Get this. Ocean recipe Rebellion. book. Always late that. Akio. Okay, where would I need to put this at? Rebellio. Oh, they got a little cloud here, a little rainstorm. That's cute. Um. That Pippin should have been here by now. Okay, so this is the. This is the Merlin trial. But what am I supposed to do? Rebellion. There's a chest up there, but I can't get sure how it fair in a little place like this. I see this, but where am I supposed to put this at? That Pippin should have been here by now. This Merlin trial is confusing. Always late that Pippin. That Pippin should have been here by now. Uh, Revelio. I only see this, but always late that. What am I supposed to do with it? Akio. Pippin should have been here by now. Always late that Pippin. Okay, push this, push it. That Pippin okay, should have so... been here by now. And she keep on saying about that Pippin. Ain't no pimps here. Nobody ain't trying to nobody ain't pimping out here. Akio. Am I supposed to shoot at me? Incendio! Oh. How am I supposed to move this? Akio! It's like a place right out of a storybook. Always late that pimpin. Girl, be quiet about these pimps and and they, and they pimping. Let them pimp. Hey, are they bothering you? No. That pimpin should have been here by now. Oh no. She said that one more time. Yeah, I don't know what to do with this. This this Merlin trial late, that is, is is confusing. Cause I don't know what to do with that round ball. I don't know where to place it at. Rebellion. See it over there, but I don't know where to place it at. Okay, so let's go over here. Um Let's 
sheep was over here. I can't believe I wasted a mallow sweet. I know this mallow sweet was in this farm. Let me see. Oh, it is. Then what is this? Could it be? I'm not in trial. I hope this one's easier. Revenue. I am seeing this. What is oh, okay, so I gotta use my fire. Incendium. And then use my oh, oh. Wait, hold up. Wait, where's, the rest, where's the rest of them? Okay, so it's one there, one there, one over there. So it looks as if I'm supposed to. It's a big And then, come on, come on, come on, come on, Hezekiah. And then, ah, the street is uh, in my way. And then, go. Then jump. Oh! So it looks as if I'm supposed to hit that, that, and then the small one. So let's see. Let's see. Hit. Hit this. Boom. You're gonna hit the middle one. Come on, come on, Neville. Come on. I mean, come. I mean, Hezekiah. Uh, if y'all if keep on hearing me saying Neville, that's Hezekiah's brother. That passed away. He died in battle. Now I'm confused. Hit that. Ooh. What in the world? Incendio. Branch in my way. Oh my god, every time I get to this one. Ooh. Ooh. I think I get to this one. So it's not that one. Can I use my spells while I'm on the boom? That's crazy how I can't use my spells while I'm on the broom. So I will have to hit this one. It's a deal. Oh. Oh. Incendium. Oh my god. Oh. So it's time. Oh, how am I gonna do this, y'all? How am I gonna do this? How am I gonna do this? So, I'll go here. I think I might use my broom. Incendio. Okay. Boom. Come on. Come on. Come on, get off. Boom. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh. Okay. Mm, there we go. Did it. I, I don't know how I dashed, but I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it.
Okay, so I got that one completed. Now, I do, how did I die? Oh. Okay. Let's go over here. Oh my god, don't go up too high, Hezekiah. You're gonna be the Dementor. Go back down, go back down, go back down. Hey, this is a long way. I'm traveling this far. Another, uh, early trial. Ah, uh, not enough final speed. Okay, so if that's the case, let me just go and continue with the mission. It was right here. Why am I all the way up here? Where am I at? Where am I? Where am I at? Where am I at? Where? What? I'm right here. Why am I all the way over there? Where's where's this woman at? She's all the way over here. Oh my god. Let me fast travel. Got me going all the way from where I was originally at. I wasn't all the way up there the first time when I needed um. Mallow Sweet seems a pleasant enough little place. That Pippin should have been here by now. All right, be quiet about this pimp, Fatima. Madam Luang, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have your brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. Why did you buy them? Why do you keep ordering from him if you think the quality to be inferior? Mm -hmm. It would seem I have more and more customers who are trying to stay out of sight. I'm not one to judge. You can simply imagine the stress I'm under to deliver quality products. Unlike some vendors, I strive to keep my customers satisfied. Here are the potions. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so simple? I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a cannot out of me until you prove the potion works. How am I supposed to do Take that? It. Uh, I'd rather not. I'd rather not, but if you insist, so be it. I do insist. Oh. I'm supposed to drink this. Drinking a visibility potion? Um. Okay. Invisibility, invisibility, invisibility. Here we go. Then how am I supposed to drink it? L1. See, look, it works. It works. It works. You see? It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, She's a, mm. I suppose that could mm. do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? <laughs> Not such chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us had to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Can you tell me? No, I don't care about your customers. Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. Um, may I see your wares? What do you have for sale? What are we looking for today? Uh, okay, I'm gonna sell that. Um, sell this. Okay. Thank you for stopping in. 
I appreciate it. Return to Harry Pippin. <sighs> Harry be pimping. Let me look at my what's name. My quest. My quest this is. Okay, one more. Oh, I make conscious. What? Inventive Advancio. Okay, Confrigo. Okay, new professor we using the summer corridor learn a curse with Sebastian. Oh, Sebastian will teach me a curse, y'all. Let me, help, let me help give this a pip and talk and talk to Professor Weasley and, and, and learn a new spell. Whee! Don't go up too high. The Dementors is coming. Whee! I can't wait to get my bird next. The Hippo Grave. Going down, down, dee da dee da da da. Dee da dee da da dee da. I said, bro. Whoa. Wee. Whoa. This is a long way. Oh, okay. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Come on in. Healing potions are a speciality here, should you need any. Okay. I delivered the potions to Fatima Luang. Very good. And uh, did she cause you any trouble? She wanted me to try it. She was certain difficult. Right, she was certain, certainly didn't want difficult. To go. She was quite cantankerous. I do truly appreciate your help. And at least it's done with. Thank you. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Pippin. Likewise. <laughs> Mr. Pippin be pimping, y'all. Every feed have someone capable deal with that wench. By the way, I found this book of potion recipes in Kingbridge. Might it be useful to you? Is this Fatima's recipe book? Fatima? I feel like a team. Um, I didn't realize. Oh, I had no idea it was hers. Some things are sacred amongst potioners. I shall return it to her immediately. Okay. Am I done here? Ooh, potioners cat. Oh, I'm almost level 22, y'all. Um, now let me go to uh what's the main quest let's see okay so we're gonna to take these last two quests then we're gonna call it a night y'all let's see let's meet with professor uh weasley we are going to fly there I can't fly now because I'm in a hard mood. Let me get out of hard mood so I can fly to this uh, Hogwarts.
Whoa! Imagine just flying to school. Like, that's crazy. He's flying to school. Revelio. Oh, can you use Revelio while I'm on my what's the name? On my broom. We don't know is it in the um any um cages on top of this castle. Then where is the room of requirement? Am I able to reach the room of requirement? It's, it's like it's up in the air. Revelio. page oh there wouldn't be no page I w it won't be any way for me to um because I can't use my other abilities okay we going down down da 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 okay we rebellion Let's go and meet with Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley. So who's is this? Sebastian. I want to go to Professor Weasley first. Um. Ba 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 da ba 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 da 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 da. Who is this? Professor Weasley. Crack crack. This way. Rebellion. Ooh, it's a bell. It's like this other car up there. Can I fly? Oh, no, I can't. I miss out the school. Who <laughs> could brat? Duncan owes his reputation to you. So how am I supposed to get up here? How am I supposed to get up here? Rebellion. Welcome back, Maddie. Welcome back. Okay. Are we? It looks like it's coming from Rebellion. that. Yeah, it's coming from that. That statue is here. Let me show. I guess I have to learn the spells to get that. Ooh, a chest. Ah, Rebellion. That thing right there. I can't catch her. I gotta find. I can't find my TV remote. The and 
the historian's uniform. It was brilliant solving those old treasure maps. If it isn't the treasure. It's like the sunrise. Revelio. I can't wait to learn that um, unlock ability so I can unlock these locks. Okay, let's begin. Professor Weasley? Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Uh oh. Oh yeah, when I got that, I was like, finally about damn time. Oh, the room of requirements. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me, and I, Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? We shall, you, Professor. Oh, oh, no, no, oh, no, oh, no, why this game is doing that right before I'm about to go in the room of requirements? I guess the, I guess the game is saying you ain't required to go in the room yet. <laughs> no. Resume. How did it going to do that to me? The disrespect. I hope it's saved too. I hope it's saved. I hope it's saved. I hope it was an auto save. <laughs> Please! Please let there be an auto save. It should have been auto save. Me and 20. Okay, yes. <gasps> <sighs> Good. Weasley. Okay, let's probably go to the room requirement. Oh. I would have been real mad if it didn't save. What is this place? This is the womb of requirement. It only appears. Xbox don't have these really problems. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room this entirely is the first time ever by happened. accident, if ever. I'd only planned to suggest. No, it's not the first time. They haven't seen you in another game too. By walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need, but you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now. Where is Deke? Hmm. He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor. The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. All these pay all these books flying around. Are there any flying pages since there's so many books flying around? Rebellion. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. This oh, let's pretend that Deke is, is Dobby's great, gra great, great, great grandfather. Spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things. Here Evanesco? In the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Evanesco sounds like a slang, some, slang some liquor. Yeah, y'all drunk some of that Evanesco? <laughs> she teaching me how to make liquor. Hey, new spell unlock. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Okay. Okay. Um... Excellent oh. work. You'll note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Yeah, but collect a lot Let's of those. Revelio. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? What is this on the floor? What is this, Professor Weasley? Is that goodness? My 
my old school back. I wondered where that had got to. Hey, I waited for you here for ages. Still here. Perhaps you were assigned I'll a few more inches of parchment than you this. expected. Give you an Let me know if you want to try to meet again. To Sincerely to you. Yes, Professor. Professor, I was paying attention to one word you were saying. I was trying to read what that letter was talking about. you keep it down some of us are trying to rest shut up revelio how do i crowd I'm gonna use what? Lumos. Um, I think I changed it. No, did I change it? No, it's the same as my um, wizarding profile. I think the only thing I changed was the core type. I think my core type was something different in my wizarding profile. But the wood type is still the same. I made sure that was the same. Rebellion. I hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. This is a big room. Stop them. Rebellion. No, not us. That's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin. Thank you, thank you. You know, I, I try, I try. They defended the room, thought I needed a bath. Cheeky thing. Oh, they're trying to say you stain. They're trying to say whoever wrote that note, they stain. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? Yeah, this place is big. What was that? What was what? Revelio. Was that a golden stitch? Oh. What's that doing here? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> Shut up. That's why I'm, that's why I burnt your neck. Rebellion. Anything around here? No. You have a ton of it. Rebellion. I hope that house elf can find us in there. Yeah, because <laughs> you can get lost in this room. Oh, who dropped that? Who dropped that hourglass? Who was dropping this? Oh, he's already here. Why are you why are you messing with this room? This room's already dirty as it is. Guys, oh careful, huh? Oh, there you are. Oh, he's so Wait, cute. Right there. Deke will come to you. <laughs> Hello. Oh, Deke, we've been looking for. How come they made him look so cute, oh, Professor Weasley? And Dobby, Deke was Dobby looking through ugly. some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed, it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. Oh. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Ow. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The room of requirement will always be equipped for the seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deke's seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. 
You seem to have accessed it in its form as the room of hidden things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Oh. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Okay. Just big close man. your eyes. Big Imagine man. the room precisely as you need it. Okay, I'm in McDonald's. I see the kiosk. The room will do the rest. I see the kiosk. I see the employees behind the counter. I see me scrolling and trying to get what I want with the kiosk. I see the tables. Oh, it's coming true, y'all. I'm seeing McDonald's. I'm seeing it. <laughs> Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Ooh, about to hit me in my face. This room is dangerous. Can room give me a girlfriend? I'm lonely. <laughs> You've given yourself quite a canvas to work with. Look, he's smiling mad hard. I look forward to seeing what you do with the space. Ah. And it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. You have unlocked the desk of description. Use it to reveal the magical properties of any identifiable gear that you can. Ooh, I got one. I got one. I got one. See, I, all of that. All of that just for that? Are you serious? A tan cloak? Let's see how this tan cloak look. Where is it? Ew. No. Put this back on. No. 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 I'm gonna sell You'll it. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Okay. Revelio. Are there any pages in this room requirements? Okay. It would be nice if you go to this room, like, say you like, be like on a beach or, you know, somewhere, like on a vacation. Would I be able to go to this room and think about the vacation that I want to go, like the place I want to go to when it happens, like it appears? Like say if, I'm go say if I want to go to Paris, would this room turn into Paris? I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. I mean, I did, no. but they gave me something I'll I don't want. I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes. I like her the suit, though. The magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Conjuring spell? Oh, man, conjuring a demon. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I, I did. sure did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plants and brew potions in class. Okay. I got a conjuring spell. Oh. Oh, so 
this is like The Sims. Okay. It's like Animal Crossing. Oh, he changed the size of the thing? Oh, I like that. Okay, conjuring a pottery table and a potion station. A potting station. A potting table. And a potion station. What do I want to use? Probably this one. Okay. Wait. Okay, and then a pot and table. Table. Well, I can also change the color. I wanted to match the pot in Ocean Station. Uh, let me get another one. Let me see this one. Okay. I think it was green. Okay. That more like a dark green. Okay, let's just let's just pick green. Okay, so this is my pot and this is my pot and areas over here. Well done. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Yeah, do not underestimate his insights. Um, I'll just learn more about Deke. Can you tell me a bit more about Deke? He's been at Hogwarts longer than I have, and seems to know it's every nook, cranny, and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and Now, why is she wearing that glasses if it have no lens on it? I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready. But again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. Does it have lens? Oh, can I use it? Yeah, I want to know this. Can I use it anywhere? Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. We've charms in place to enforce that. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. But the room of requirement has its own rules. You look mad. You like you telling me you gave me this this conjuring spell and I can't use it outside the castle. I gotta use it in this room. That's what he's saying. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer. Do my glasses got a lens like to, to learn it? another transfiguration spell Oh, it does. For use it's just really, room. really cut short. Hey, we're level 22. We got one talent point. To be honest, I don't think I might be in this room a, a lot. Like, I don't think I might decorate the room. I don't... Uh, I just might just come in this room to to conjure some potions and some other stuff. And probably to, uh... Uh, uh... See un unidentified gear. Other than that, I don't think I might have anything else in this room. About transfiguration, if you have a moment. Okay. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. 
Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. Already got that. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the room of requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. I got a lot. Come on. I got a lot. Come on, let's continue. Let's talk. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? Okay. Conjure wall decorations. Five conjure floor decorations. Five. Okay. Let's see. Wall. Let's see what we're going to put on the wall. Get some artwork. What is this? Mm. A pain depicting a, a witch who seems rather irritated with a wizard. To be honest, I don't want none of these pictures, none of these paintings in, in this room of requirement because what if I meet up with Natty, right? And you know, I want to do the do with Natty in this room of requirements. I do not want to see, I do not want these these paintings to see us doing the do in the room of requirement. It's required for them to not see us do the do, okay? I don't want them in here. And then they'd be, they'd be gossiping to the other paintings. Like, I don't want them to say, oh, uh, uh, Hezekiah's uh, uh, stroke game is weak. Like, I don't want to hear them say all of that. Like, really? Making Hezekiah feel embarrassed. I do not want them to be doing all of that. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't even don't want the bat up here. Let's do the butterflies. I'm just saying, Maddie. I'm just saying. I'm just looking out for the what ifs, you know, in case in case Natty and I want to, you know, want to do to do. We got we got the room we got the room requirements to do so, but I don't want the paintings to be talking about us doing to do. I'm not really big on interior designing. I'm more into like fashion design, like customizing the character and putting clothes in the character. As far as it's like coming to like uh, putting stuff in a room, I'm not good at that. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, let's put this on the ceiling. We're gonna put this on the ceiling. You know what? You should put it right here. Right I wanted to put it on the ceiling. Um, let's add some flowers. You know, add some flowers. Wait, wait. Probably like right there. Probably like another one right there. Okay, now it's time for some room, some floor decoration. We're gonna add a rug. You know what? Um, Hezekiah don't want a rug because he got asthma and he don't want the rug to trigger his asthma. So, uh, uh Deke, you gotta move off the way. Deke, you in my way? I gotta, don't be playing. Don't be cleaning the floor right now, Deke. Wait till I'm done. Okay, you in my way. I expect me to decorate my de decorate this room if you're in the way. Um, a table would be nice. A table would be nice. Um, 
and some cheers. Um, I can have one over here. Have one over here. Wait, no, flip it around, flip it around. Okay, take this one and have it over here. Like that. Can I move this? How do I move this? Um. Oh, I want to move the chair. I want to rotate the chair. How do I rotate it? Okay, just forget about it, kids. Forget about it. And then we also gotta have we also gotta add flowers on top of the table. We gotta have flowers. We gotta have flowers. What is this? Utility. That's what it's okay. We don't really need that right now. Um He said I'm done. He said my back hurt. <laughs> okay, we're gonna add a statue. Oh, we need we need some flowers. We need some flowers. We're gonna add that in the middle of the table. Oh, we can't. Okay. Let's add some more stuff to the floor. Ooh. Oh, I've got no furniture. What about this? No, we want no, we don't want it to be, we want it to be round. Okay. Rotate it, rotate it. And then change the color. All of them the same color. Oh, I see the kind of, I see where the color is at. Right there. I want to rotate this table. I mean, this chair. Okay, there we go. Okay. Um, let's do this again. Uh, get the chair. Uh, I want this. Rotate it. Rotate it. Right there. Boom. Good work. And then, Shall we move on? Wait, not yet, not yet, not yet. I'm in my groove right now. Okay, right there. We got one chair over here, one for Natty and one for me. You know, when we have our date. We I can invite us to remove requirements and we can have a little meal on this table. And then if she wanna go to sleep, if she wanna go to sleep, if she wanna go to sleep, I gotta put a chair. I mean a couch. Okay, put it right here. We can sleep together on this couch. You know, in case you wanna, you know, in case you wanna go to sleep somewhere, we can go in this room real quiet. Maybe we can sleep right next to each other like this. She can lay down, and I'm right behind her, cuddling her up, spooning her up. Okay, now I decorated a place for Nanny. You think she's gonna like it, Professor Weasley? Are you think she's gonna like it? I've conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. Oh, the altering gonna... spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Oh my god. I don't care about the altering spell. I need the spell to unlock these locks. That's what the spell I want. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the altering spell. Okay. You know what? Let me switch this, this category to this. Boom. Boom. Um. Boom. Uh, so this section over here is for my room of requirement spells. So let me go back here and then get rid of this. Get, I can't get rid of it. Get, get, get rid of it. Get rid of it. Okay. No. How can I get rid of these? I don't want them there. 
Okay, just forget it, forget it, forget it. To customize it. Which one was it? Was this? Change the style. Oh no! <sighs> I don't like this quest, y'all. Rebellion. Protego. I do not like this quest. I don't care about decorating this room. I'm only really. I'm pressing the, I keep on making it go away. I just, to be honest, I'm really decorating this room for Natty, for Nazi, okay? And if she come in this room and then see, she said, oh, this all you did? Then she can do it herself. Elect, ooh. Yes, this is better, this is better. We gonna keep it like that, we gonna keep it like that. Um, the size, the size, the size. You know what, Nati, Nati, she probably might want this to be a little bigger. Pause. Okay, she probably might want it to be long and probably a little bit more bigger. We're gonna make that small for now. And we're gonna move this. Uh, move that. No. Move that. Move it! Now I don't wanna move. Move it. Uh, we're gonna push this up there. Push this up there. Um, make this scientific walls. No. Then we go into, uh, um, change the size. Yeah, yeah. It's too big. Pause. I'm making medium size. Making medium size. Uh, it's too high up. Bring it down. Yeah, right here. Right here. Right here. So she can look at herself. Um, change the color of an item. Let's change the color of these chairs. Make it white. Nicely done. And then you're ready for something a little more advanced. Please, no more. Spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Also, the balcony or the floor of the room. <sighs> Give my chair back. Rotate it. Rotate it. Don't. Rotate it. Rotate it. Okay. Um. Conjure. You're gonna conjure. And then. Alter the balcony. Alter into what? Oh! Okay. And then the floor. Ooh. Ooh. This one is nice. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? I mean, Natty can do that when she comes over. Mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. You think or uh, you come know? And talk to Deke when you're ready. I don't want to know. I do not want another one of these room of requirement spells. I want the spell for me to unlock these locks. 
Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I don't care. Um, a cool moonlight ambient sound perfect. I like to see something natural and earthy. I focus best in a room that is dark and mysterious. I say a cool moonlit ambience. I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Oh, sounds perfect. Oh. Oh, this is romantic. Oh, I like it. Hmm. Quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Oh, this now is romantic enough. Now you have enough. learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. Yes, I'm done with this. Oh. I mean, it's good that they allow you to customize the room of requirements, but I'm not really crazy about that. I'm not really crazy about customizing the room. I just want to customize my character. Ooh, they save it. Oh, they got that ready for me and Natty. Who's the third chair for? It's two more chairs. An even bigger space. It expanded? How did that happen? The room equips itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spellcrafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. Okay. Hey, y'all. Welcome to Pit My Room. Let me show you my room of requirements. All right, so when you first come in, you can see that it's set with this moonlit ambience. It's like as if the moon was shining through the room. And then you see this table right here? This table is for me when I have special guests, specifically Natty. So it's only two chairs here because I'm not trying to have a whole bunch of people in my room because I don't want to get sick. Um, so there's only two chairs for me and Nati. I need this pot. I need I need to put some food on the table. Okay, there's pots under the table, but I need to put some some food on top of the table. And then over here, let me show you. Come, come over here. Come over here. Come over here. This is my potting station. So I got uh my 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 potting station for when I want to plant plants. Okay. Then I also have this when I want to make some potions. Okay. And then you come over here. Come, come over here. Come over here. Come over here. Come over. Here, come over, here, come over here. If you want to come over here, this. Is my bed. This is where me and Nazi sleep together. And it's also butterflies, you know, because I heard that she likes butterflies. And then, and then, and then what else? What else? What else? If you want to check yourself before you leave the room, I also have a mirror. I have a mirror so you can see yourself. It's kind of blurry. I probably got this mirror from the um from the uh, discount store. It's kind of blurry. I want it from like Raymore and Flanagan, uh, but I have to do what I have to do. And then there's plants. I don't know why the place is all the way at the top. I'll fix that later. And then at one corner, you see the botanical garden, the botanicals. You see the flowers and the plants. These bugs flying in the way. It's causing distraction. I need to put these bugs down because I ain't reading no bugs. Okay. Um, I got this from IKEA. I got this from IKEA. It took so it took a, a, a minute to be built. Um, but with magic, it made it quicker. Um, these these bookshelves over here. I got this from um 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 at Ashley Furniture Store. I got this from Ashley Furniture Store. Price was at like eight hundred dollars, and I got this at Ashley Furniture Store as well. What's different between this one and this one is that this one uh 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 probably got more books on the side. This one doesn't. It got pots. So this is where I put all my spices at. Like if I want to cook, so I put my spices at. If I want to read and be educated. I just come over this side and see what book I want to read. And there you have it. Welcome to my room. Now you can get out now. Don't let the door hit you with the Lord split you. <laughs> Alright. Um, let me get out of this room. Is there any pages though? Before I leave, are there any pages? Flying pages. No, it's not. 
Um, let me go and uh, speak to Sebastian so I'll get this curse spell. I'm, I'm, I'm tired of this room of requirement magic. I'm tired of that. I don't want to. That is. I don't know what we're gonna do with that. Rebellion. Let me go and speak to Sebastian. Oh, what happened? No pages. I can't wait to learn this curse spell because I needed something different. Okay. Weasley think I'm an interior designer giving me all these room of requirement spells. I don't care about that. Okay, I want to be a powerful wizard. I want to avenge my brother's death. I don't care about me having these decorative spells. What well, you came from? Okay. Uh, why are you looking up for? I'm not up there. I'm right here. Talk to me. Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, you show me? let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the professors know about this place. Okay. This way. There's a secret passage just here. It's well disguised. Oh, this. I always want to know what this was. It's the Undercroft. How did he know how to uh, open this this Undercroft? How do you know how to open it? Sebastian ain't coming in with me. How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. He named it the Undercroft. We used to play golf zones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal Rebellion. Game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep this between us. Your secret is safe with me. Never confide. I mean, can I tell Natty at least? Can I tell Natty? She's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize her. Can I tell Natty? Sneaking here almost daily. We've never been caught. I mean, if it, I mean Sebastian, can I keep it real with you? Is it okay if I tell Natty about this place too? Rebellion. I think I've seen Ominous in potions. Or was it Herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, <gasps> one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Obsessed with blood status, most of them. Ominous cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to, away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the Blasting Curse. The Blasting Curse? Professors curves. say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. Well, we see how look you said, but you're gonna tell me, right? You're like, you, but you're gonna tell me, right? 
That's ridiculous. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. Mm -hmm. My thoughts exactly. Exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic, but you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. Okay, yes. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Not for Mimic me. by wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. Okay. Boom. 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 Confringo! You're getting it. Yes. Ready to actually try it? Yes, I'm ready to try it. Uh, where is it? Confringo, where you at, Confringo? Is this Confringo? Ooh, a long range bolt. That deals damage on impact. Enemies hit with fire based attack will continue to take damage for a few seconds, during which time collisions will result in a seemingly burst. Ooh. Let's use that for that. Stick to the targets, though. Best to keep the Undercroft intact. Rebellion. What are those candelabras? Both have their uses, but I think you'll find that a Confringo Confringo a nice work. How's it feel? Amazing. That's it. I think I've got it. Well done. It feels amazing. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. Um... I'm ready for more spells like this. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. Exactly. There's Not that requirement magic. I've been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. Haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do... Perhaps when I next head to Felcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. I mean... I don't want to end up, I don't want to end up meeting your sister Sebastian and she end up falling in love with me because my heart, my mom, body, and spirit belongs to Nadia. I don't want to end up. If your sister is unwell, she may not want visitors. Meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. Trust me, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Very well. Let me know when and I'll meet you. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something is... was missing from what you found in the library. Might it have something to do with Victor Rookwood? He didn't mistake you for someone else at all in Hogsmeade, did he? Nothing gets past you. I'll tell you what I can. Rookwood and Ranrock are trying to recover something they think I took from a vault in Gringotts. Gringotts? When were you there? Professor Fig and I wound up there after the dragon attack. There was this port key that... A port key? To Gringotts? Mm -hmm. Well, it's all a bit convoluted. I'm listening. Why does it feel like Sebastian got a crush on me? Because think about it, think about it, think about it, think about it. He wanted to meet his sister. And, and, and who? His uncle? His uncle or cousin? Like, he wanted to meet his whole family. Sebastian got a crush on me, y'all. Um, you must promise to keep this between us. I trusted you with knowledge of the secret Undercroft. You can trust me. All right. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours... He's still on hearts Does this allow you to wield this magic too? I... I... I don't know. Well, when you do know, tell me. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, 
with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you. I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting curse is in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. All right, I got you. I got you, fam. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. I got you, bro. Revelio. Sebastian. Wait. Uh-oh. You there. I can hear you. Oh, I didn't say Hello. nothing. I didn't say nothing. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you yeah. just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? I stumbled upon it. That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? No. You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with the headmaster. I'm not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. I will blast you. No need for threats. You needn't threaten me. I'm not going to say anything about your Undercroft. And Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant- I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to Shut be up. earful about this. Good for you. Shut up. I'm blast you with this curse spell. Oh, now you're going in here? Oh, Sebastian, somebody come in, Sebastian. <laughs> All right, let me see. All right, y'all, there you have it. How, how long have I been streaming for? Almost five hours, let's go. First and foremost, I, I, this is a this was a long stream, guys. I'm sorry about that, but this game is so good. Like, like I said, you it feel like you've been spending spending 30 minutes, but when you look at the time, time be flying by when it comes to playing this game. Um, but I appreciate I appreciate y'all for coming through and watching me play this game. You know, taking time on your busy days to watch me play this game. Um, tomorrow I will be back playing this game. Um, I'm not going to have I'm not going to um. I'm not going to uh, uh, play a scary game tomorrow. I'm actually going to play that first week of March. So that Friday of that first week of March, I will be playing a scary game. So be on the lookout for that. Um, I want to. The reason I'm playing this game tomorrow is because I want to get you know kind of far into it. And um, yeah, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your Thursday. Stay safe, and um, hope you have a good night, good morning, good evening, good holiday, whenever you're watching this. And um, Deuces, y'all.